new fence. Okay, so I Can hope Badger don't give a fuck. This is <laughs> God. I hope this is uh, it is recording, and I hope it's going correctly. But we'll find out when we're finished if it sounds like shit or not. <laughs> so I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. I've never used OBS, but we out here. <laughs> now you may continue with your Can you intro. It out? Yep. The only thing you hear is like screeches of demons, like. Ah! <laughs> I know the screen is all distorted and... Well, I tried to... No, the, yeah, we the visuals look fine. I tried to lower the desktop audio so that it's not going in the red or anything. As long as you guys don't screech or anything. And my audio is a little bit lower than y'all's, but should still be clear. As long as, you, as, long as we don't screech, we shouldn't have said that. I, I like the name of this podcast, the Dumb, dumb Gyms and Dragons. <laughs> Wait, is that the name? <laughs> no, the name of the podcast, Dun Dungeons and Dragons. Oh. That's that's gold. We need a name. Are you recording right now? Yes. That's why I said oh. you start. Yeah. We, we, need, we need to get up with the name, but yeah. Go. Yeah. Is everyone ready? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Uh, last time... Uh, you guys but Justin with a quest you um, returned to a local seven you proceeded to um, a one sit down take a drink as a goat barged in with a scroll uh, was a uh, Persian read, read it out loud as uh, a one on stood the goat he said his name was Shambright he um, escaped and was interrupted by a uh, one orc three wolves and uh, a bear uh, barging in and wanting the code. You guys, after some time uh, in combat, you defeated him, uh, them all. You looted, and then you decided to own it. Uh, then you decided to uh, hide the bodies. Uh, the way you decided to hide them was in the basement, <laughs> uh, trying to frame the the owner. Of the establishment, he he doesn't know yet. He got scared. Uh, oh no, my bad. Uh, he started running as Persian tried to fawn with him. <laughs> yeah, that's when we left off last. Okay. Um. I had an arrow. Everyone, I please had, initiative. I was gonna say I had an arrow knocked and was just screaming, basically, Corbat, kill this motherfucker!" <laughs> <laughs> so I, I just opened this door, and I just hear, I, I see this man very like running fast. He is. You just have a bucket full of mopped here, up like blood. <laughs> uh, I, just, I just mopped up this blood. I see you with an arrow ready. I just fucking kill him. Do we have to roll initiative? Yeah. Yes, please roll initiative. Okay. Oh, did, did my thing pop up? Uh, nope, may, but I can just add you. No, oh, I rolled 19. Hold on. Wait, and uh, just enter your, uh, what you got. Okay, so they got a roll. What's the step like that? Alright, let me re roll it then. This is the first time I've rolled like a fairly high initiative. <laughs> <laughs> All the times it was a 6 to 10. It wasn't very good. This like guy is running, he's gone. <laughs> Throw the bucket at him like a bucket is safe. What, what, by the way, what, what is up with these civilians up in the off, you know, up to the right? Or, yeah. I imagine they're sitting back down, or they went home, or either. Well, uh, they're sitting down around. Okay, so they're so they were back, and after this all happened, they calmed down and. Yeah. You know. Oh, yeah, I'm going to make you miss it. Before last session. Wait, maybe, maybe not. Maybe not that smart to put them at that table. There's still like some blood, and the thing might add just the might axes. Oh no! I, t I took the axe out, but like that table is destroyed. 
<laughs> yeah, um, give me a second to populate you. Honey Badger don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, Honey Badger. Honey Badger don't, don't give no fucks. And these two went home. Three people left, Sham right here. Okay, um, why did it not save? Ugh. And that was a four. Okay, give me a second. Sending. Okay, it's his turn. Oh, it's for fuck's sake. Okay, um, Kana is Simon, is Simit, uh, si Simon, actively trying to stop him, like. Sorry, echoing very badly. Uh, oh. are you plugging the way? Uh. No, no, I'm standing to the oh. side of him. Oh, I mean, Unless, did oh, his feet think, get cut away from what he walked from I think, the grave into the building already, or? Did you mean, did you mean, is he standing here, or is he standing here? Like, is he blocking this, are you blocking this doorway? Yeah, yeah. are you trying to oh. hold him in? Well, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm blocking this doorway to the, his left. Okay, okay, good. Whether he was okay. or not, he can't walk through an enemy space. Can't walk through enemy tiles. Oh yeah, but if he wasn't plugging, uh, I would consider it friendly. Well, we're in initiative, and I did just say murder him. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's it's how Simon would react. I would take it as. Oh, and by the way, the door where I'm standing at is uh, the door is, what's it called, opened, but I'm standing like I'm, I was about to walk through the door. If he oh, runs past if he runs past me then I well, can get I shot am, with I'm an arrow. In the, I'm in the door I'm in the doorway but the door is open now. Oh yeah yeah. He's going to walk up here. If he runs up past here, me he gets shot with an arrow. This is I had already I had a ready action before we left last time. This is how I know Facebook is watching. You read it your action? Before we left last time I said I I'm gonna knock an arrow for if he tries to run like if he tries to run I'm gonna shoot him. Okay. Um, I said that before we left, I had to go to the bathroom. What? Oh. He's going to scream for help. Help me! They're trying to kill me! Go over here, and in this turn, because he can't go any further. Are you- wait. Uh, Simon, your turn. I just wish to move over to this doorway right here. And block his path from entering out this way. Mm? Actually, no. And can I move down one more space? Of course. Let's move down to that. Yeah, uh, do you use reaction? Um. He's currently like flanked, you would get advantage if you attack. Yeah, if you attack, advantage. Oh, yes. Uh. Can I use my? Hmm. I only have javelins equipped at the moment. <laughs> uh, you can use an ultimate interaction to pull out a weapon. Yes. To stab him. Oh, my bad. Actually, not divine fury. What's this? Ah. <laughs> oh. All right. Never mind. Yeah, but can I use interact? to get a weapon. Yeah, you uh, pull your... Uh, what weapon do you take? Great Axe. Okay, you pull your Great Axe out from your back. What do you do? Uh, am I able to attack this turn or am I just... Uh, is that the end of it? Or do I have to use a bonus? Yeah, you can attack. You still have your oh. action. Oh. Yes, can I attack and I'll roll it now. Wait, please roll for it. There's a 12 hit. Yeah, uh, 12 hit. Uh, you kill him. Oh, jeez. Five How slashing. I'm gonna go in the way of Condre and just slash him straight down the middle. Hmm? Straight straight down. Down. It's split. Uh, Let Andre. us out. Yeah. What's Condre? In the old, uh, not speaking in this <laughs> way, of course. Slash him from head to head to leg. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, he's fucked up. Oh, we you shouldn't have done that. No. Uh, 
because now, uh, you know, the evidence is going to be pretty, you know. It's okay. It, it, it's okay. We'll just it, take the money in the jar, find all the stuff in here, and burn the whole place to the ground. No, how about this? We kill every single civilian inside. Are we in free action right uh, now? Wait, that is a big guess. Uh, is Kovac, you see all the civilians looking scared. Would they have seen that behind the wall, though? Uh, no, but they would have seen the blood splitter uh, a bit on Kovac. Oh. And when they talked about <laughs> killing them. Oh, touche. Kill all the civilians. <laughs> find the corpses. So... Can I can I now since he's dead is this an initiative? Nope. Okay, or okay then. So uh, Simon, do you end your turn? Yes. Okay, person. Hmm. Okay. So I have that. I can walk through friendly spaces. Hi, Vic. oh, hello, Victor. Hi, Victor. Sorry, I went to sleep 6 a.m. yesterday. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna walk through these friendly spaces. Hey, and... I imagine you almost, like, as you try to rush through me, I just, like, kind of <laughs> dodge aside with the bucket as not to spill it. I'm like, excuse me, excuse me, pardon me, excuse me. And I'm, like, jumping through them. <laughs> and I just walk into the main area, and I'm gonna try and persuade these villagers in here to just stay quiet and act like nothing happened and we'll make sure that they get all the drink and food that they could ever want from this establishment. Roll persuasion. <laughs> yeah, roll persuasion. This better be a really high persuasion check. <laughs> better be not funny. Not funny. <laughs> I don't know how I'll go. Not funny. Persuasion is, what's it called, is is charisma, right? Mm -hmm. Can I like since my turn is right behind him? Can I help him with that? Mm -hmm. Not one. How? Uh, oh no! So you can just roll on your on your own soon. Yeah. Sixteen. Um. This guy is a bit tipsy. He seems to like your idea. I feel like with a two, I just walked out and just went. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm so so they just saw like this blood splatter. I imagine like one one of the halves that fell, they they just see this like puddle of blood leaking out from under the door, and they just heard the scream. And it's, it's, and, and it, you're we're screaming at them. You get free food. You get free food. And this. <laughs> like I didn't. Drunk guy is like, oh, fine. I feel like my character didn't register what happened to the bartender at first until he like looked over at Korvac and tried to give his speech, and looked behind him and just saw these two split halves of the bartender that was previously there, and it was just like, ah, 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 ah. <laughs> I okay, just couldn't so, talk. So this, so this guy is with us. What, what, what were what, the other two? They seem concerned with a, a leaking blood pool going out to watch your feet, Kovic. Hold on. So... Yeah. Kovac, I think we should... So, is this with or without my pers persuasion check yet? Because I imagine... <laughs> okay, so this is... Yeah, okay. Just like... Did, uh... Whisper to Kovac. Crushing the... Uh, maybe, maybe, yeah. maybe we should just, maybe we should just get rid of all of them. No. <laughs> yes. you, you understand. Sorry, Eldritch Blast. This guy, or well, well, you know what, this guy. Mm. Go to it. Uh, it's a thirteen hit. Yep. I mean, he's, sitting, damage. he's sitting still. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. He's dead. As this Elvish Bleem blasts out from you, uh, he splatters uh, blood on the wall and on the uh, window. It's open, it's broken, isn't it? It's broken. That's yes, the broken it window. Is, it is. That's the broken window. <laughs> mm hmm. <gasps> 
Oh no. <laughs> this is collateral damage. <laughs> no, is there it, still anything I can do as a bonus action? Like, I don't know. Uh, Your character. <laughs> well, let me let me let me check. Uh, actions. It's not civilian death. It's acceptable casualties. No witnesses. The two weapon fighting is only with like handheld weapons, right? Yeah. I don't think they have any Wait. weapons. I have a battle axe. Oh no, I thought you meant the villagers. No, but I have two weapon fighting, but that's only with. Yeah. Held weapons, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um. Do I have anything? Because you can. I thought it. Could you use stuff? You if you have any spells or stuff like. Well, no, you don't. You just use Eldritch Blast. I just use Eldritch Blast. Yeah. But then I think that's it. Oh. Um. It's Thomas. This guy. He he's almost asleep. Swamp this guy looks scared as. Fuck. Okay, okay, I, I won't tell you one. Please don't kill me, I got family. That's good advice. Well, advice. we'll make sure that they die too. Simit, your turn. Am I able to use movement then attack or is that not allowed? Pardon me? Yes, you can Am use I movement allowed? and attack. Oh. You can move through us to sense enemies, basically. Mm -hmm. No, that's, that's not how it works, that one. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> God damn it. Cut around the corner like a and you just... Alright, so I'm gonna move to this bot here. Wait, you um, do it right around or just through? Just go. Hold on. I'll show you the movement path, sorry. Yeah. Oh. And then I'll. Use my bunny uh, javelin. Mm -hmm. I don't want to lob a javelin. It, it, oh, no, I appear to have opened normal 32.png. <laughs> Please watch it. Uh, yeah. It appears you have opened something something PNG. Uh, I'll try and roll it now if it lets me. Roll the funny sticks. The funny javelins, sticks. By the way, I. Where do we hit him? 16, I think that hits. Where do oh, you hit where him? Do I... Yeah. I hit him. Oh, mm -hmm. in the skull. Just Go straight up in the skull. Um, as he's pleading for his life, talking about his family, he should have straight in the skull and he falls backwards. I forgot to move Honey Badger last round. <laughs> honey Badger, don't give a fuck. <laughs> We are slaughtering innocent civilians. It's that we're all evil, but we're slaughtering innocent civilians. Well, I think my, my, my fucking, uh, what's that called? My alignment has changed. Oh, because my, my alignment has always been evil. Well, I, I think mine changed from neutral evil to chaotic evil. I was chaotic I neutral. Chaotic yeah, no. Mine's always been chaotic evil. What do you mean, man? Yeah. Just killed a man pleading for his life. No. Nope. Um, as you guys did that, um. Shine Bright! Oh no, Shine Bright! I was. What did you miss to? What did you do? Kill the goat. It's okay. So. I, I go. Look at Shine Bright. Can you, Shine Bright? Can you delete the mm -hmm. turn order? Like, try, take it off the screen. Shine bright. Mm -hmm. Nothing is going on. We are. This bartender just showed us that he was together with these villagers in an evil cult that and was trying to kill us. And Deception. not Deception only check. that, they were part of the orc and nook party that was coming after you. They was just they were just waiting until you let your guard down. And they were going to attack from behind. Oh no relax. <laughs> please roll deception. Please roll deception with advantage. Comic. Yeah, comic. Alright, just quarterback. back. Boom. Nineteen. Yeah. Nineteen. Uh, okay, fine. Uh, I will care anyways. Uh, you can just just hurry up. I don't know how long the scroll will last. 
well, can you help us with the bodies? I'm not sure. So as I, like, at the end of this, like, when I say, can I help you with the bodies as I'm walking over to some of them, I lodge an axe in this drunk guy's face. Like, top down. Jesus. It's like, can you help us with the bodies? Slam it into his forehead, you know? It what into his forehead? My battle axe. Your battle axe? You hit him? <laughs> I wanna him him. Right now. Yes, I want to hit him with my battle axe. I launch a battle axe into this guy's face. In the oh, that guy. guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, we'll sit. He's asleep, so advantage. Oh, oh advantage, yes. Mm. Thank you. He's blackout drunk. Okay. <laughs> you smash down beside him. He sleeps through it. <laughs> uh, minus one, because I'm a minus one in strength. <laughs> is there is there a better Wait. weapon like a dex weapon? Yes, there's a lot of dex weapons, but I just kind of like walk over there and I'm just like, it's okay, I'll deal with this one. And I just take a dagger and just precisely like assassin esque. Uh, clearly, I've been doing this for a while. Right into the jugular. Please roll damage. Why does he have to roll damage and I have to roll to hit? <laughs> Come on. Because he went over, like <laughs> yeah, I'm just like precisely. I'm just like looking at quarterback, like this is how you kill sleeping people. <laughs> yeah. I knew he lives just one HP. I imagine he out. does this. I imagine he does this. Oh my god! Can I get like the what's it called? Is there like a hidden blade? Like uh, they have an Assassin's Creed in D and D. Hmm? Probably. I mean, yeah, I'm sure there's like a homebrew. A like yeah, but honestly, I would so just insane. I would just do it as flavor. Like, you just use the damage of the dagger, and you say it's a retractable blade. Yep. Yeah. Instead of using an action to attract to Can to I... pull out a blade or some shit. Okay. Wait. Uh, Can I do have... that with uh, what's it called, Rog, or Rog Gore? What did Victor say? He left. Uh, I don't know. He left and he wrote a paragraph. Where? Doesn't matter. Um, okay. Okay, uh, you guys have the dead bodies. What do you do? Is Shambray just trying to pull this guy at the, uh, like, uh, foot? <laughs> trying. Okay, guys. So, we can't just let uh, acts like all these were just a bar there. Okay. Look, we can act like we, so we can tell the guards we took care of the bartender because we noticed he was a bad person. Well, why tell them but anything? the rest of these gotta go. Why, why tell them anything? We'll just hide all of the bodies. Close the shop. We have the keys from the bartender. We close the shop for a few days. Come back after we've dealt with Noak. And, um... If they ask where the bartender went, we can just say we purchased it from him and with enough gold, sent him on vacation. And with the missing villagers? Well, it must have been wolves. Hello. I pretend. Yes. Uh, do you guys hide the bodies in the basement? For now. Yeah, uh, you guys do that. And then we... And then, uh... Can I investigate the rest of this uh, bar to look for like a padlock or something to lock the basement up again? Because we broke the first one. Yeah. Um. You find. Uh. The time that all the oh yeah oh, I'm sorry. No, it's fine. Uh, no, no, no. Well, I in the time that they are all like cleaning up the bodies, I wanna just spend my time. Uh, like fixing this wall and the uh, window. <laughs> you know? not, not, like, while they are cleaning up the bodies and like finding a padlock and everything, I just want to fix the wall and the window and just mop up a bit of the blood. You can certainly try. Did, what, do I have to roll anything for this? Uh, how are you going to fix a broken down wall? Uh, can I look like. Uh, you know this really beat up table? Mm -hmm. uh, can I like put it on his side so like I chop off the legs 
and like put it so so you only have like the table like walls but like like, 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 like two by fours board. yeah like just this so i just have this big board left and i place this against where the wall used to be and i just nail it to like next to here where it's Yep, you do that. Do I have to roll anything or? No, you guys got good the amount of time. And the, now the window. Hmm. It'll be fine. We'll just say. Uh, there was a rowdy. Yes. Kids. Well, there was a few rowdy bar. bar um, customers. And one thing led to another. A few tankers went through the window. Man went through the wall, and we fixed what we could. What's on? Uh, what does Simit do? I've literally just got back and I'm still unaware of what's going on. Oh, my man. Can we do like a long rest during this? Uh, yeah, um, yeah, you, yeah, it won't take the longest if you would like. Yes, I would like that. I wish there was a way I could juice up my pelly. My big old giant badger friend. Yeah, no, no, of course. I, um, I was actually over there to stop by work. I'll say, if you guys, uh, you'll oh, get full health if you also take care. Uh, uh, yeah. yeah. I know, but I mean in the sense of like. Besides leveling up, there is no other way to get his health above what it is right now. Ah. Uh, is there a thing? Because, that, like, in the basement, is there, like, a big oven or something? Well, there's, a, like, a cook there's, like, there's a, like, a cooking stove right here. Yeah, that is two ovens. Because, I mean, was, uh, like, maybe I want to burn the bodies, you know, until it's ash. Mmm, crunchy. Okay, um, uh, before you guys take a long rest, uh, Shanghai is going to tell you where the, the location of his base. And um, as he finishes, he tries to say, and that's. and then, bah! The scroll went out. Huh, that's, that's, that's perfectly fine. And since I did take a long rest. Um, for now, I'll hold off. There's no need for him to speak. Um, he gave us a general location of where the tower was. Mm -hmm. uh, can you get a bit close to a mic? Oh, my bad. Um, he, he gave us a general location of where the tower is, right? Before the yep. spell ran out? Yeah, just as the spell ran out. Alright. As long as we know where we're going, we don't need to talk to him anymore. Davis, <laughs> hey, lad. Shine bright. Can you nod? Are you coming with us? Nod. How, how, do, how does he nod? Yes or no? Hey, oh yeah, my man. Yes. Well, you nod your head or you shake your you nod your head yes or shake your head no. Ah well. So very well then, and we I guess we head off towards the tower with Nokin tow. No kin to. Like yeah, like that yeah. Means something? Well, no, like no kin, like or not no with uh shine bright in tow. To like, huh? like in tow means we've got. Yes. Ah. Like you know how you tow like a boat behind a truck. Yes. That that's what in tow. Like, that's what it means. We've already been through all this with police. Words. And I imagine, uh, well, what's it, uh, is taking a nap upstairs. Or, or she's here burning the bodies. Um, as you guys go out, uh, Scarlet is now. She's gone. Last time I checked, Fort Deal was what? Two billion dollars? Oh, my network is meaningless. My only objective Traitor. is to make the world a better place. Rebellion scum. Oh, wait. No, sorry. I knew we shouldn't have left the letter in on this. 
<laughs> nah, sorry. Um, my bad. I forgot. I actually found something better. Um, <laughs> yes. Uh, which one of you drag out? The... Me, but probably. Yeah. It was my idea first. Huh? <laughs> yeah. As you go out there, you see no scarlet, but you see an egg. In the colors of red, blue, purple, and a bit of cyan, green. I put the egg in my backpack. Mm -hmm. Because... How big is the egg? It doesn't matter how big egg the egg is. <laughs> I will carry it until the end of time because I protect all that Artemis births. Hey, that looks egg pretty You touch it, no, you'll stab you. You don't even eat. <laughs> you can make an omelette. You touch you it. Don't even eat. Listen, Come on. listen here, Warforged. If you touch this egg, I will stab you in your core. Okay. Okay. Hey. Just keep your eye on it, yes. Persian, please roll Arcana. Charisma? Arcana. Oh, Arcana. Oh, history. I didn't hear you. Uh, they're the same, it doesn't matter. That's <laughs> it! Wow. It's the second oh, no. that one. <laughs> Wow. Egg. It's an egg. Egg. I it's like colored it. light, scarlet, where scarlet was. I imagine he doesn't even know what's an egg now. <laughs> it's a ball. It, no. it, what is this object? It's a rock that I felt Artemis's energy coming from. Do not touch it. Ah, yes, of course. The rock. This is, this is my mother's energy rock. He's always you been a mama's boy. He's always been a mama's boy. He's always been a mama's boy. Why? Why thoughts exactly? Well, you should. You, you would be a mother's boy too if your mother was a goddess. If my mother was there. Uh, very well. If your mother was alive. <laughs> she's alive, but she left me. Well, you're a robot. You have no parents. She's alive. Ah, yeah. I wouldn't, I wouldn't know. <laughs> just really, I just, like we're just sitting here like insulting each other, like... <laughs> the true chaotic evil I group. Have a mama. At least I have a mama. <laughs> like, the most true chaotic evil group. You throw a chair at me, do I have to roll something to dodge it? Throw a chair at you, well, like, at least I have a mama, I just throw a chair. Hey, I'm standing in between y'all and I like dive out of the way. <laughs> Do I, do I gotta roll something to dodge in the chair? <laughs> okay, please. I am actually prepared to go to the tower. Athletics. Let's do athletics. No, um, please roll. Uh, or how's the rule for improvised weapon? <laughs> um, I just do, like, strength stuff. Oh yeah, my strength is minus one. But he is throwing. But he is throwing it. So throwing normally goes off of dexterity, though. So it's up to you. Um, that is my strength. The man can't even strength. pick up the chair. That is my dexterity. Yeah, it is strength. Yeah, I'm going to rule it like that. My man you, can't pick up the chair. You pick it up. Throw it. It lands on the table. In between you. <laughs> <laughs> you literally hear my badger snickering. As you're all laughing at me, I use my, uh, wait, what's it called? A bitch blast. My control flames to, uh, from the campfire, grab this big ball of flames. Ro robot, I'm gonna fucking melt you. <laughs> As I'm just like moving it towards him. Isn't it just like a small, like one by one area of flame or something? Or is it five by five? Let know. me, let me, let me exactly read it. You... What, am I, what am I meant to roll for this one, Chief? Nothing. Oh, okay. Do I you said how he rigs. I just die. Just keel over. <laughs> you just melt into a puddle of goo. Just fucking die. I don't remember if this is control flames or. Oh my. 
Games. You can know, but it's thaumaturgy also has something to do with control and playing. Oh, yeah. That's right. Shape fire. What are, tre what are tremors, by the way? Uh, it's like. You, tremors? It's like earthquake. Right. Impending doom approaches. <gasps> This was supposed to take like 20 minutes. Well, <laughs> what, I can, what I can do is move, like, I can expand the flame, providing their f five feet, providing there is fuel, but then it would burn the tavern. Because then it would use the wood from the floorboards and the tables and chairs as fuel. I just imagine, yeah. I see him going to cast control flames or whatever it is. And knowing what he's doing, I just go, Stop. You're going to ruin my plans of owning this bar. Do not set this place on fire. <laughs> you get me almonds. <laughs> After- give me, give, me, give me a fuck ton of almonds. Korvac, I told you. That's part of the plan, but we need to save Shinebright first. He's part of this. Now we must go forward to know. I mean, we can kill Shinebright and get the almonds now. I'm, I'm, saying right loud, beside uh, you. I'm saying this loud enough for him to hear. Yeah, he's standing right, right beside you, mate. But then we lose out on the magic items. And whether you want almonds or not, I want magic items. Alright. Like, can I... Can I pick up Shinebright and put him on my shoulder, or is, or is he like big? It's a big ass sheep. I mean, he's like 90 pounds. He's like 90 pounds. I picked him up under my armpit and ran with him. Yeah, but like, oh, you, can I pick him up uh, like up to my shoulder? Um, sure. Because it is under my carry weight, which is like 127. <laughs> Wait, hold up. I just uh, if it's you go, 160 to 180. Go in it. Yeah, go yeah, we discussed it. It was like 90. That's what you said, uh, Nick. Okay, yep. Go to weight carried, and click on it, and it says carrying capacity 120, push drag 240. Weight carried. Uh, inventory? inventory, it's on the very top. Oh, yeah? Click on it. And a sidebar should come up. Oh, uh, yeah, carrying capacity. Oh, push drag or lift 240. Yeah, we have the same strength, so... I was in the heat of battle, so I had to pick. I had to roll to pick him up, but. Yes. What's going on now? We believe you're in danger. I feel like we with this. I feel like with this, you can just like heft him up, get him nice and comfortable, and then me. Uh, how how big is a giant honey badger? <laughs> I don't think they're actually that big, right? I don't think they are either. What do you want to do with it? Love it. Put them on like a backpack. Right. You can do it. Uh, yeah. The D&D &D giant badger is 14 to 16 pounds for females, or 19 pounds for males. And he's a male, so he's 19 pounds. They're... Yeah. You <laughs> I, I searched up honey badgers, they look so cute and small. They are fucking adorable. So yeah, I just like, I tell him to get on my back and he puts his like little paws over my shoulders like a backpack and his little feet around my hips and he just sits on my back. Kind of like where my backpack is already but like latched over it. Yep. That's a funny looking skunk. That's a funny looking skunk. This... Although a skunk would have also been really cool because you could have made him like made everyone evacuate from the war. Poison damage. <laughs> because so poison damage is spooking people and making them run away. Well, because he's on my back, I don't give a fuck about you calling him a, a skunk. So I'm just like, yeah, it is a funny looking skunk, huh? And begin walking towards the door. I like it. So I, can I? Well, I bring Shine Bright with me as well, so. Us, the animal handlers just like walk out the door heading for Shine Bright's castle or castle tower. Um, Tom. Tower, yes. Wait for me. 
I'm coming. Move on. Wait for me. <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, by the way, so, before we leave, I locked the tavern. Do you need some oil for your joints? You seem to be moving a little slow there. Yeah, I, th I think I need to. I think you're metal gun is worse. Oh, got it on you. <laughs> I think your metal is rusting. Yeah. Better boss is avoid the hinges. Yeah. Well, sorry there, lad. Don't got no oil, but hope you feel better soon. I just continue walking on towards the tower. <laughs> That's gonna do me some. That's gonna do me some good. <laughs> we get back. The wolves are like running the tavern. <laughs> I'm just locked in the tavern. <laughs> I was too slow. <laughs> Let me out. Well, no, <laughs> he would have waited for you to come out I think before we left it. Yeah. I think no, we were in this tavern no, way longer no, than we should have. I think we <laughs> caused way more havoc than we should have. <laughs> oh, it's fine. We we just just in in civilians. What do you mean? We just killed like no, three. We just killed like one quarter of the town. No witnesses. <laughs> no, it is no quarter of the town. This is a big town. It can't be any. Anyone to or witness if there are no witnesses. Okay, this is maybe well. a, one hundredth of a town. Very well. Hopefully nobody will notice I'm missing. There can't be any witnesses if there's no one to witness, right? Right? Burn down the village. <laughs> burn, oh baby, burn. So what's the next map? Okay, give me a second. Uh, I'm seeing stuff up. Uh, GM layer. Okay. Nathan. As you guys travel to where you got sold his tower was, he was correct. Uh, you guys just give me a second to make sure I didn't forget that. This guy, yeah, that's also the guy. Oh god, everything is black. Yeah. <laughs> Porky, you racist. No! What? <laughs> he wasn't the one that said anything yeah, like that then. You thought it. Hmm? Um, no. No. Oh god, everything is African American. <laughs> oh god, okay. Relax now. <laughs> I don't want to be racist or anything. <laughs> Which one's worse? <laughs> what are these gorillas? Give me a second. I thought we were going to Shamrite's Tower, not the zoo. <laughs> What's the difference? You know you can use the other shape tool and it'd be a lot easier to clear big areas. I got you, fam. Yeah, it takes a little getting used to, but you'll figure it out. Uh huh. I believe what I believe. I'm gonna say what I want to say. My company's gonna cure cancer. It is. It helps if you like, what I do is I say something's a circle, I go across the circle's edge, and then I go out to where I know there's grass, make a square, and then go back to the circle's edge. Did that make sense? Nope. Okay, hold on. Freehand. I'm gonna draw a bright yellow line because your yours is bright yellow. Because I know the map. I'm sorry, I'm gonna do this real quick, but basically that is the circle, and then there's all grass here, and then you go like that, and then you go like that, and boom. Oh, like that. Do stuff like that. So you see how it's kind of square shaped, but it goes around the, the circular edge? Ah, oh, like that. Oh, yeah. Roll 
The fact that I know this map without being able to see it, I'm so sorry. Like that? Yes. Don't be sorry, dude. <laughs> it's just funny because I, how how close was I to the circular line when I just drew that now? Give me a second, I'll show you. I looked at the map, the first thing I see is three gorillas. That's funny. Was it close? Yeah. Red side. I was literally like right there. And I even turned, I even turned where that thing is. Mm -hmm. I went here, up, down. <laughs> That's funny. Now you see why it takes me so long when I'm... Like, yeah. Yeah. It's why I'm like tempted to pay for the yearly thing where it does the automatic. Like as soon as I put your token down, it clears the black for me. Of what you would be able to see. It's like live fog of war. Oh yeah. So as you move your token around, I don't need to do anything. All I have to do is draw where I want the walls to be, and it will draw shadows as I need it to. What does that mean? Oh uh, God, so and like whatever you already revealed will be shaded out, but it'll still be there. So, so we can see what there is, but if you move enemies in, yeah. in that space, we won't be able to see the enemies. Exactly. Or like actual bit. There. Exactly. Because we we know what the room layout would be, only not the what's what going on. And I think it's only like twenty five dollars a year. I will fire you. Was on that much? I might buy it soon. I'll see what's up. Cause I have to pay for my incarnate soon too. That's how I make my maps. You just can not take a bit of time. Give me oh, some time. Oh, that's all right. I think yeah. Connor is gone for a second uh, as well. No, I'm here. Oh, you're back. Okay. I've been here. I've just... Yeah. I'm just gonna change the music. I've had number one and number two. Oh, shit, I forgot to join the watch together. I'm in the watch together. I just had it on mute because I forgot to turn it off from last time. There's been music all this time. <laughs> yeah, I forgot to watch together as well. <laughs> What's this? What's that that you're unrevealing? No, music. Oh, it's called Songs for a Dying World. I like this song list. Especially this guitar. Mm. Because I don't really, I'm not a big fan of the ones that are just like town ambiance. Yeah. I am, but it needs to be the right setting. But yeah. When, when you're actually, like, when you just an, enter like a thriving town and like people are out instead of just like, oh, you're in a tavern. <laughs> is, is that what you mean? Like, if I'm at a tavern, I want like tavern music and people talking and bar and da da da. -da. Yeah. Unless there's a fight going on, then I want fighting noises. Oh, I had a mix volume, that's why it was so loud. <laughs> and then, like, stuff like this where we're waiting for the DM to do stuff, or we're about to go into an area where it's like, we need to be sneaky or secretive, it's good for some music like this. I think all the important stuff is ready in one second. 
You, uh, spy, you know what you should see. You can't see anything you shouldn't. Yeah, right? you're good. Good, good. Unless you want to reveal the whole left side where the trees and stuff are. The left top corner. Yeah, that's up I'm to about you. to do that. It looks actually really good how you did it now. Thanks. Except for that, like, one annoying line to the left. Right there. Like this one, this one, like, oh, yeah, that one too. This and and this, but but you're you're good, you're good. <laughs> Is it gone? Mostly, yeah. No, no, it's hard to get it. Yeah. But it's, yeah, all, it's, it's all right. Um, yeah, sorry. It's really hard for me to see because like it's a uh, see through. Okay, so put your uh, you're on the GM layer. That's a pretty terrible thing to do. Mm -hmm. If you go to it, you can actually change the density of what it looks like. <gasps> The opacity, that's the word I was looking for. Yeah. Dense. I don't know why. I don't know why it's a density. I know someone who always, who, who's, he always says, you disingenuous, dense motherfucker. It's facts. Obviously, you have to know something about something or you couldn't tie your shoes. That's facts. Based. Based. <laughs> Also, the, the same guy uh, was like he played uh, chess in uh, what's it called? The game What Dogs won. Or D chess. And he, yeah, so he played chess, and then he lost. So he made a lot of jokes, and then he blew the person up, and he was like checkmate, motherfucker. And then if you want. You want. Hey, I'm done now. Oh, I was gonna say, if you want, you can do this area like. Oh, like that. Yeah, sure. S Spaggy, can I get a loan you in the secret corner for a second? Yeah. Oh, uh, this is gonna. Oh, God. This is gonna be in the recording. Okay. What's up? Uh, the room with the trees, right? Yeah. Is that open roofed or something? Yes. But okay. you, we can't see it from the ground. Yeah, I know. Perfect. Thanks. So, like, what you have here, besides what I just drew, is perfectly fine. Okay, thanks. All right. Chase it. Talk about it. I don't know. So yeah, you can see. This always my Fridays are always really bad, except for D and D. That was the only thing good about my Fridays. Why? Oh look. I said my Fridays are always really bad, except for when we play D and D. That's the only thing good about my Fridays. Oh, why? Is everything okay? Yeah, everything's okay, but like every every Friday, something shitty happens. For real? Yeah. I have to work every Friday. Oh. What? I work every Friday. I, uh... So where are our tokens coming from? Uh, right down. Uh, you see these three? Apes, they're playing cards. Uh, great swords laying beside them. Are they big? They're apes, bro. They're fucking gorillas, my guy. Wait, apes? Are they gorillas? It's apes. I mean, they're medium. I just picked up my desk. So they're about, about as big as me. Yep. They're like Only six foot monkeys. Monkey. Why do you believe so strongly that making gold is a fraud? It's a big, big monkey. They're like six foot tall monkeys. I'm not okay with that. Monkey, this. man. I can give you almonds. You gotta drag your guys' tokens in. I don't think they want almonds. Uh, yeah, you're like, uh, pitch your feet more down. Just. Just gotta move over here. But I, we can see the tower from the distance. Ah. Okay. 
Uh, I, I stick a jump right on my back. You said we're like 50 feet from down. 50 feet down. Yeah, man. I've got a skunk on his back, and the other one's got a bloody goat on his back. So we see the we see the apes from where we are, at least. Yeah, they're just seeing pink cards. What? Uh, I was gonna say I'm gonna wish you a Korvac. That's quite strange. I've never seen apes play with cards, and I've lived in the woods most of my life. Do they actually understand what they're doing, or are they just throwing them around? No, they appear to actually be playing. I believe that's poker. Do I know if it's actually like poker? I'm just taking a shot in the dark. <laughs> yeah, definitely poker. <laughs> Okay. Say, oh my god, send me to the mountain. There's a mountain of chips in the middle of them. <laughs> no, they're trading Wait. bananas. <laughs> it's just a pile of bananas. <laughs> no, they're playing with gold coins. Oh. Where did the they... rich monkey. Where did they get those gold oh. coins? Oh, hold on, I'll, I'll, I'll get this. Can I walk up to the monkeys? Uh, With, like, a big pile of gold coins in my hand. Before he does that, I'm gonna hide in the bush. Like, here. Before you do that, give me a second to read this. <coughs> um, red of stone uh, or glass, the house fire seems to have been formed from the living branches uh, of four sturdy oak trees. Uh, these have been shamed uh, and uh, woven to create three, three thick platforms. The lowest of these is roughly 40 feet across and sits about 10 feet from the ground. The only obvious route is gentle slope formed of roots and branches that connects roughly with the main path. So, yeah. floods. Um, I, I believe this is the tower that we've been looking for. Um, though, I do believe that you should go gambling first. Hopefully, they don't seem too dangerous. But. This seems well, like quite a climb. Well, maybe you should come as well since you can speak to animals and stuff. Ah, you're quite right. Quite right. I was gonna hide in the bush over here and I like point at the bush, but you know, very well. And I just follow Korvac up to the gorilla or apes. So we just stop right there. Stop right there. Okay, so observe the sniper team has two here. Okay. Um. As this guy see this guy sees you, he grunts out and they pick up their long swords. He's showing initiative. Oh god. Let's go. God damn it. Oh I know that's the wrong character, hold on. Let's go. What? I just kind of like dive into the bush before this. Can I, can I say, can I like hold up a oh, big pile of coins and say, we're here to play? Like, what are you. A rough persuasion. Oh, great. So. Well, can I help him? Can I persuade them? I actually want to play poker with them. Yeah, persuasion. Yeah, but look, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not persuading them. Well, no, we, we have to persuade them to let them join. Oh, alright then. I'm gonna actually uh, help him. And I hold out my bag of hold too. Okay. <laughs> uh, please roll with advantage, by the way, because he also holds his gold up. And I'm like, hey! We're friends, we're friends! <laughs> they like look at you, um, talks to each other. Uh, this guy, wish you over. Put down his long sword, wish you over. I kind of just like go sit here next to, next to them and I make some space for uh, Persian. Oh no no, I'm gonna sit on this side. Or, or the side. All right. <laughs> A simit join. And I just why not? I sit down next to them <laughs> and I hate to do this, but I am gonna use one of my spell slots. Because I assume they can't speak common. Sprint over. No. Right. Are, you, are you like, whenever they tell something, uh, you telling just you telling us what they were saying as well? 
Yeah, I'm gonna use my spell slot for speak with animals. Oh, look at him and go. Hey, now that we can have an actual conversation, I don't know if you guys understood common before, but... How y'all doing? Uh, just like to get a little game in every once in a while. Happen to be traveling through the woods and all. Yeah, two, two seconds. Sorry. Well, I'm like. Whispered back. Oh. oh. I was just like, oh well. I was just traveling through the woods and figured, get a little game in. Saw you guys playing over here. Assumed you guys couldn't speak a uh, normal common like we could, but hopefully you understood some of it. You understood money, definitely. Coin. One of them says, and it uh, points towards the gold. Uh, gold that's on the ground. I flick and shove. Oh yeah, I sh as, as I imagine you're telling us what he what they they're saying as well. I literally just look at him and go, he literally just said coin. Like, you're a, you're, you're a man of great words, and I shove like ten gold coins over into the big pile that's in the middle. I throw in three. I just whispered a call back. What's going on? Well, uh. We're gonna play poker with these apes. Do you want? Do you want in? I don't know what that is, but shove in some gold coins in the middle. I, I'm just putting like six gold coins. I just look at him and go, shove in some gold coins and pray to your gods that you're better at luck than they are. I just put in five gold coins in the middle. Uh, do I, uh, by the way, uh. So, what was the name of the? Do, 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 I don't know if you made a name yet for the demon that gave me my powers. Uh, no. Uh, if you want to just make one up, do it. Why well, I don't have names ready? Okay, Sparky, you're good at names. What is a good name for an evil squirrel demon? An evil squirrel demon? David. It's an evil. It's an evil demon, but uh, he is in the body of a squirrel. Actually, you would know him as Squirrely. Ceratos. Ceratos, you'll know him as Ceratos. Ceratos, come on, give me that luck. You actually get a ability later, little that's like that. <laughs> get Ceratos. Should I use? Should I use my I one? I am. <laughs> should I use my one divine blessing from my mother to roll on this? Yes. <laughs> uh, give me a second. Uh, what, do I, what do we have to roll to? Uh... <laughs> yeah, give it a second. If I roll a nat one, I'm gonna be very, very angry. I imagine it will be like a d100 rolling for luck. Nope. Well, I used to play a game called Dicey's. It's very simple. Uh, okay, uh, I, I think I found some rules, but... Just give me a second to read them through. I just do a d20 plus your proficiency bonus, and whoever rolls higher wins. <laughs> yeah, we are playing dicey. <laughs> proficiency? Where's my proficiency? <laughs> it's like plus two. Oh, there we go, plus two. Yeah. yeah. I was <laughs> like, I was like, it's so much easier. Inspiration for this to roll, to roll twice. Do you have an inspiration? I have an inspiration because you know the dragon. I saw what the. What was going on at the beginning screen, you remember? Hmm? It's gonna What's say... What do you add on to it? Is it performance? So I just rolled 2 d20s and then plus 2. It's gonna say wisdom, but it's oh, just I because it's 20. plus 2. Um, oh, that's that's how you do it. But, um, it got 19? but hold on, I want to use no. my... Wait, what's it? What bonus do you add on to it? Oh, plus wait, 2. Uh, the add-on is your proficiency bonus. You can proficiency. see it... Yeah, you can see it at the... Um, Right over initiative. Next to charisma. Yeah, I rolled acrobatics, but that's also because of the plus two. Yeah, that's um, actually charisma. I'm gonna do. Yeah, right. I'm gonna do my one it thing that that lets me talk to my Artemis mother and use my advantage. Hmm? Oh, charisma proficiency. Yeah, nineteen. <laughs> yep. Fuck yes. Oh, you bugger! Give me my money. No, give me a second. Sparky, you slap. How much are you each bidding? I did three. I put in five. 
Wait, you want to put in five? Just That's fine. For the record. I've got a thick coin right here. Very heavy. Oh, I dropped it. I dropped the coin. Hold okay. On. Um. Yeah. Uh. Person, do you want the money? So that's five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. How much did you put in Korvac? Twenty-five gold. So what? I, I put in ten. You put Please. in ten? Okay. I I put in ten coins. So. Okay, you get thirty gold. Thirty gold. Let's go. I can assist one of the monkeys to you. Um, I don't like to test my luck. Uh, Friend, again? Uh, he points towards Kovic. Alright, but you guys are not putting in money, but if one of us wins, you guys uh, lead us the way into this tower. Uh, persuasion. With advantage. While this is going on, can I try and sneak off and get into the tower by myself? Yeah, give me a second. Um, maybe, if you win. Maybe. Uh, if you win, we'll come and flip. One of them says. Well, like, what? I mean, while he's having a conversation with them. I want to, like, try and roll a stealth check and, like, hey. sneak off. I'm assuming he's using you as a translator. They can't talk to him. I just... I, want to see you. I know. Because I imagine... Yeah. But as soon as he gets their attention with the coin flip thing... I want a Batman. You know, you know how when Batman be having a conversation with somebody and they turn around for one second and then they turn back around, he's gone. You. Yep. I'm trying to do that. Hmm? That one. <laughs> stumble and fall, face into the, the fucking ground. <laughs> okay, Batman, you're gone. Me and Pelly, off in the distance. Away! Hold on, let me check distance first. <laughs> mm. God damn it. There we go. It's on my back, but, you know, just wanted to stay hidden. Hmm? So I kind of, like, press up against the wall, like, uh, Mission Impossible style. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna let them do what they need to do for a second, because obviously I feel like I need to take rounds, like, turns. Yep. So, uh... I I'm put in five times. Hey, you know what? Hey, give me a second. This is poker. Um, Spaggy, you get two tins. <laughs> what? You, you can you get a turn more now. Meanwhile, they play oh. poker. is a quick game. Oh, oh, thanks. Okay. Um, up in the building. I'm gonna start climbing. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start climbing the. Let's see, how far can yep. I get into the building? I want to stay pressed up against the wall. Like... Yep, give me a second. Kind of staying crouched down. Assassin's Creed style. Oh god. <laughs> can we move? Into the... Oh yeah, we can. You're playing Pogo. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, I, was, I was just checking, like, if I put my character here, will it, like, be yeah. behind the... In the thing here? Yep. Yeah, I can see him even though he's down there, so. We still need initiative. It'd be useful. Mm, no. But yes, it could be useful. Uh, uh, when, the, when the apes decide to, you know. Well, no, because yeah, no, even, even though we're playing in a free action type of zone, 
we can still take turns because it'd be like I move and then you guys are playing poker, so you make your rolls and stuff. Uh, Simit, are you participating in poker? No. Okay. I I put in five gold. Five gold. I'll, I'll put in five too. Yeah. And, and the monkeys put in uh, their what's it called? Five gold. Uh, oh, I thought they were putting in their so they would help us with the tower if we won. Hmm. Oh yeah, that's true. My They're putting in their word. Uh, yeah. 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 Oh. <laughs> One of them goes up to his mouth and puts down. <laughs> oh, I'll put down a so roll a d20, right? Oh, one d20 plus proficiency. Oh, that sucks. So I'll just do one d20 plus and two. That's, uh, plus two. Plus two. I have a twelve. Thirteen, twelve. Actually, I'm looking. Holy now. shit! Wait, wait, these two. Oh, sorry. These two fucking own you. Oh, that's uh, right. Let me say it like this. This one rolled a 21. <laughs> okay, um... They forget the gold. Um... He's going to point towards the gold pouch. Uh... What, what is he doing? Uh... Uh... He's basically sign languaging, like... Points point. to watch a gold pouch. Like play more. Uh, point. Okay. So, is there any way I can get more luck on this, or like a proficiency with it, or like so I can roll double? Is there any way I can do that? Can you, can. Cheat? you could deception to cheat, like. Mm -hmm. Can I uh, roll, but then like? Wait, can, can I roll? Just, just like I, I'll do a normal roll, so... Or, or d wait, first... Uh, well, like, you could just... Called? I'm saying, like, you could first just you do a straight-up deception, and all you would have to do is do a deception roll, and then you would not have to roll again, because if you do a high enough deception roll, you can just be like, oh, no, I won, I have so-and-so. It's my deception... Oh, my deception is... All right. You can uh, do that if you play again. Yeah, yeah, I play again, so I put in uh, 20 gold this time. 20 gold? Uh, does Simon match, match? Oh, match it, sure. Okay, um, as you guys are playing, uh, Passion, you have two rounds to do stuff. Alright, um. Can I do get a perception check on this room? Uh, what are you looking for? Uh, just making sure, scouting it out, clear. I don't want to like Wait. go and advance and wind up getting ambushed. Hmm? Please roll uh, perception. By the way, did we see uh, him leave? Because I imagine I, since we're not able to speak to them anymore, we know they he left. Yeah, uh, they yeah. seem to not care. I was gonna say I was in his line of sight, so I like gave him a thumbs up and then just walked away. They have noticed, so uh, they are they are concentrating on the money. <laughs> We're playing poker with a bunch of monkeys to not to, for that, so they won't kill us. <laughs> uh huh. This is smart. This is good tactics. Uh, so there's nothing up here with the perception trick. Nope. Uh, you do not seem to find any danger. Do we see anything up this little bridgeway? Give me a second. What you see uh, is a door. Mm, I want my token over it. Why can't? Oh. Well, that sucks. Okay, so it's a closed door? Huh? Alright. Is it locked? It's locked. Uh, well, this is problematic. Uh, with me, my audio is deciding to fail. I'll be you right still, back. You still have my crowbar. Oh, I do still have your crowbar. And... Alright. We're gonna... Uh, yeah, do we... 
does he get advantage since we're like distracting the monkeys and everything with the coin and we're like no no that's fine that's fine uh Sorry. so I'm just gonna uh try and well hold on no that won't Alrighty then, we're gonna go ahead and try and use that crowbar. This is not gonna go well. Okay. I don't know how crowbars work. Please let me. It's like a strength check or something. Yeah, okay, athletics. Ooh. Hey, hey. You get it open. Make, make some sound. Give me a second. Yeah, it's kind of unavoidable with a crowbar. It's not the stealthiest uh -huh. of tools. Crowbar, you say? Okay. Uh, give me a second. I have to describe this room, Finn, and reveal it. Did the monkey, the, like, I am, did we hear this uh, noise? No. Okay. Oh, wait. Um, 25 feet away. Why are you trying away? to do it silently? Well, yeah, I would be, because I was already stealth from before. I'm not trying to break yep. my stealth. And it's what twenty. It's twenty-five oh. feet away. Fifteen. Okay. Yeah, they don't hear. It. And what? Ten feet down. You said. I think you said that earlier. Wait, give me a second to look at the description. As you see this. Um. This middle um, platform is ten feet above the ground. No, that was the first one. Oh. Um. Branches curl around its base, creating a rough bowl shape around it. Uh, from where you stand, it is possible to see flowers and small trees growing around the edge. Uh, by far the largest of the three platforms is the middle one, which looks like around 60 feet across. It's about 20 feet above the ground and, and it's fully enclosed with a wall formed from twigs, branches, uh, tw uh, twisting branches. Uh, you can see evenly spaced window sized gaps. As well as what appears to be a door at the point point closest to the garden platform. The final. Yep. Yeah. All right. Cool. Uh, Ash, you're doing this. You see this guy. Ah, uh, why won't it work? He's he's working at his bench. Very well. He turns around. Oh shit, he heard that. Who's there? Have you, have, are you, like, I'm, your head inside the door? No. Or is the door open? <laughs> it's no. like, I just broke the lock, and I'm just, like, still standing outside of the door, barely opened it. Like, it's cracked, but I was, like, trying to peek through the doorway. Goddamn monkeys. He walks down. You hear it? Um, I'm gonna move this way. <laughs> you hear him step out of the door, open it completely. I'm just like holding my breath up against the wall in a bush. Please roll self if you're trying to hide. Oh god. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Baggy? No. Yeah. Ten. Okay. Um, before we go on here. Uh, Ivan, uh, please roll for poker. <laughs> okay, so, um, can I first, like, normally roll, and if it's a bad roll, if, like, if I don't win, mm -hmm. roll deception to, like, act like I did win and, like, kind of, quote-unquote, explain how I won? So, oh, wait. Uh, please roll. It. Also, you Connor. A 19 plus 2, so that's a 21. 21. Uh, you are leading, Connor. Uh, hold on. Wait, am I meant to roll now? Hold on. Uh, 1d20 plus proficiency. That way. 
Oh. Oh. Right. Oh. Okay. Uh, can I beat you? I mean, we're working together. <laughs> he won. He uh, won. Yeah, I'm just saying, so he gets the gold. I don't care about the gold. I care about that the monkeys are gonna. Since yeah. like, since we both rolled high, I care about that the monkeys will kind of follow our orders. Mm -hmm. Um. One of them takes the gold out, points towards one side, points towards you, points towards the other, points towards them. Okay. Wait. So, he points at the gold. Then one side, out. Finn you. Punch to the other side, Finn himself. And what did, what did they get? <laughs> We're going to kind flip if they're going to help you. So he wants half the gold. No, he wants, he's got a coin flip. And if, it, if it's like, basically if it's heads, he's going to go with you. Yeah. If it's tails, he's going to walk away right now. Okay. Um, he flips I... it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, can I choose which side I get? No, he chose. <laughs> he pointed at you and pointed at the head of the coin. Oh, like that. Yeah, as he flips it, he points at you. Uh, they stand up, take the swords, and stand ready. We got an army of monkeys. Can I get control Hold over up. these guys, or is it still you taking, like, uh. I'm controlling. Okay, all right, all right. So uh, at first, I just want to check out this room. Okay. Um. Yeah. You open the door. Anvil, do you open the door? Yes. Okay. You see an outhouse. Give me a second. <laughs> As you open the door to this outhouse, you see a fellow on the toilet. Oh gosh. <laughs> Taking a shit. How do you not roll it? Real. Oh. As I like slowly creak open the door and see this beer, I use my thaumaturgy to instantly slap this, like, jam the door, well, like, it just flies shut. <laughs> like, bam, just shut. Okay, um, they, it'll draw out. I don't care. Okay. Uh, everyone. Roll initiative. Uh, I'm going did. to remove the old one. Oh, yeah. my old one's so good. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, wait. Yeah, I, I'm going to let you keep the old one because you're still in the same thing. Yep. No, no. I thought, I thought it's re-roll. I thought it's re-roll. Nope, you don't. Over three. <laughs> Over three. Yeah. 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 I started a new one. Yep, please roll. I mean, uh, we both started a new one. I, did, was, did this bear look any, like, did he look like he was gonna hurt me or he was mad at me or something? Um, it, it roared when it saw you. It saw oh. the toilet. I'd be mad if someone walked in on me too. I instantly clo well, close the door, I just, like, slam. I'm sorry! I'm dead. Yeah, give me a second. <laughs> you got the same roll. You really no. did. Hey, what's your dexterity modifier? I didn't get the same roll. Last one was a 20 or something. What's your dex mod? No, you guys should. Yeah. Um, I think he's a. Fine? I think he's a 15. Huh? Is your dex 15? No, it's. No, it, it's not. What? No. What? My dex is 14. 14. No. It's fine. Doesn't matter. They were different. Okay. I'm really confused. What, huh? If, yeah, I'm really confused too. I, I yeah. thought one of them rolled yeah. the same as you. Yeah, same. Oh. What, which rolled the same as me then? Neither. No, no one. <laughs> he doesn't. Honey badger don't give. He doesn't Why have do a you turn. Roll for the honey badger? He goes That's on my not turn. not the honey badger. Huh? Uh, no, it's me that rolled for it. Just ignore the honey badger. <laughs> I accidentally marked that token when I rolled for initiative. Oh. You're a weirdo, Betsy. You're a weirdo. Is it? It's... Aw. Not you. I was talking to my mom. <laughs> she called my dog a weirdo. Ah. You called your dog a weirdo? My mother. 
Why? Who did she uh, call a weirdo? My dog. Pers Percy? No. Betsy. It's a doggo. Why is it weird? She is oh. weird. <laughs> Happy <laughs> dog. Sparky, I've seen cool. your dogs. <laughs> Yeah, oh, you yeah. have? Yeah. Those couple I've chips fell off you when you got they're out pretty, of the They're pretty dog. weird. <laughs> oh, yeah. And then she goes like this. Lucky. You get to see Yeah. <laughs> like, that was good. Yeah, because I have a video Where's camera now. Huh? Yeah. There's not a bag in that box? I just don't find Dogger. Okay, I'm almost done. Just gonna say it. Sparky, when Doggo. Really good reveal. Doggo reveal. Uh, next oh, one. Okay. Like do your turn. Yeah, you wanna try to hide better? Panic. <laughs> um. <sighs> you know what? No, I'm not going to. As I always have it prepared, I'm gonna shoot him in the tits with a long bow. So you prepare your action? No, I'm gonna. I I'm saying as I always have prepared my bow. Ah, yep. So, skip eight, uh, skip ten? No, nope, I'm shooting at him right now. Oh, okay. <coughs> yeah, roll damage. Oh, hold up. Baby. Gotta check this one. Could be nice. Nope, never mind. Yeah, uh, you roll nine. Okay, I just shoot him. He gets it right in the shoulder. I'm seeing if I have any hey. bonus actions. Holy. I do not. Well, I do, Holy but I forgot. I, I do, but I forgot to do it first. I meant to do Hunter's Mark first, but I forgot about it, so can't really go back. But I can do Hunter's Mark now. Or... Is Hunter's Mark then activated for your next turn? Yeah, it would be. But actually, instead, I'm gonna do Zephyr Strike. Yeah. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I hate that it does that. You need to hit this one. Oh, yeah. So basically, I just cast it on myself first, and then on my next turn, that stuff happens. Okay. Uh, and that's the end of my turn. turn. Yeah. I'm going to baby. I'm going to need some water. <laughs> we have an army of apes. <laughs> we turn to monkey. <laughs> Oh no, he's gonna get out and just enter, like walked in on the bear on the shooter. He's gonna hate me in a second. What are you gonna do? Um, well, first off, I'm going to hit him with an arrow. Okay. And then I'm gonna get 60 feet of movement speed. Oh yeah. Okay, so once I get 60 feet of movement speed. Combat. So once I get 60 feet of movement speed, I'm gonna go like this. Can you see my arrow? Yeah. Boom. I mean, can you run past Wait. him since he's an enemy space? I can shove. Oh, yeah. Because, no, um, my... Shove him off the platform, like, at the bridge. My the, the bow is gonna do force damage. I mean, which, I it would stagger uh, him, depending on what Nixo says. I don't know. I'm hoping he'll go with that. But, either way, um... I need to get him to move, actually. You're not wrong. He's right in the door. So that's not going to work. Yeah. Is there anything I can do here? Or... Six... I mean, is it like 60 feet of continue? Oh, no, wait. Then you have to wait for your next turn to shut No, I only have 60 feet until end of turn. I have to... Literally, what it says is I have to... Uh, once before the spell ends, you can give yourself advantage on one weapon attack roll, so I'll have advantage on the next attack that I shoot at him. 
uh, does force damage on hit, and whether I hit or miss, my walking speed increases by 30 feet. So it increases another 30 feet, so I get 60 feet until the end of this turn. But I have to attack. So I could go like, now that I know he's here, go here, 35, 60, hide inside of that bush, and then cast my... Just divide an action. So I can cast my primeval awareness on my next turn. So not this next turn, but the one after that. Yeah. And I expend one of my spell slot. So my last spell slot is going to go towards this, but it's going to be worth it because my longbow is going to be so, so much better. And he's going to hate me because of this. I can sense whether there are any aberrations, celestials, dragons, elementals, fays, fiends, or undead within one mile of me and within up to six miles if I'm in my favorite terrain. My favorite terrain is forests. Is this, would this be considered a forest? I believe so. I'm back. Hi. Fuck you. Um. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. Okay. Uh, no, I didn't hear it all. I yep. heard some of it. Yep. Yep. Hi. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah. Uh, do you end your turn? Yes. Summit. I, I have a question. What does yeah. DK stand for after Nixo? Denmark. All right. Wait. <laughs> I don't know if I want to use that though. Never mind. I'm not gonna use that. I'm gonna change my whole plan. But no, ignore it. Good question, I'm 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 happy you didn't assume like some other people I've talked to that it's for Donkey Kong. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I was like, oh, <laughs> fuck. <God."> <sighs> now. Just, <laughs> I, uh, so Apple just tried to close the door, right, and not alert the bear, right? So I know. I I saw the bear. It roared at me, and I used my thaumaturgy. So I didn't close the door myself. It just slammed shut. You know when you walk in on someone in the bathroom and you panic and you slam the door in their face and you're like, oh my god, I'm sorry. That's him right now. No, yep. I didn't slam uh, it in. The, I didn't slam it in his face. No, but not like, like obviously he's on the toilet. But you know what I mean. You like slam the door. Yeah. I just want to see if I can whack down the door with a great axe. Or the wall, sorry. Oh, Jesus. I, I wasn't listening in the watch together. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna move up one spot and see if I can whack down the wall with a great axe. Is that allowed? Wait, so you're going to whack down the wall? Attempting with a great axe, if that's allowed. Would sure, you even know there was a bear in here? Oh well, he heard the roar. Never mind. Yeah. That's literally the max damage I can get. Wow. Well, what what is it? What do you roll for it? Oh, a D12. A D12. Oh no, that, that's not the max yeah. damage. No, it's you not. No, it's Your max D12. damage is 15. Yeah, but it's plus three. Oh, oh, my bad. But. It's a so you don't know if you don't know what an outhouse is, it's literally a small wooden toilet that's outside. I know what it is. No, but Nick, so me and him were talking about it earlier, and he said he wasn't sure what an outhouse was. Oh. I just told him it was a toilet, but. I, I imagine it's even smaller than it is now. It's just like only the toilet, really. Yeah, it really is. It's like, the, it's like a small shelf, that's just with a cutout hole that goes down into some water. Have you seen Shrek? Yeah. Think so? Exactly. Have you seen Shrek? Uh, like the six movie? years ago. Okay. Do, so... do you remember the where where it's like somebody wants to be like mm, that part mm. where he walks out of that small little hut? <laughs> oh yeah. That's, that's an outhouse. House. Okay, that's a big one. This one. <laughs> oh, anyways, um. Yeah, you break it down. That's a bear. That was your action. Well, that's because Incarnate doesn't really let you draw much smaller than this. Unless they use Dungeon Scrawl, which even that's even harder to get smaller. So, does the bear get reaction to this one? Do I get reaction? Wait, no. It's pooping. Oh. 
You can just slam down the outhouse. Is, is like the whole outhouse destroyed? No, just the wall. <laughs> so there, there was just now a big old hole in the side of this outhouse. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so do I get reaction or? What do you, you have a bonus reaction? action? Oh, oh I bonus action. Uh, let's do you see have what two weapon do. fighting? No, he uses a two-handed weapon. Oh. Two weapon fighting. Oh no, that no. doesn't. No, that one doesn't work because it's you use a great action. I use rage. You rage? Okay. Yeah. Uh, should I? I don't know if I should copy and paste it. But. Oh yeah, you can. Yup. Are you rage? Nice. Angry armor. <laughs> Error. I'm very angry, so I'm le uh, so I'm harder to hit. <laughs> yeah, because logic. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense, but sure. <laughs> it's not that you're harder to hit. It's just you're so pissed off that your skin gets hard. Because mm, logic. No, because the blood flowing through your body is like literally tensing the muscles. Yeah. Oh, I got one question. Um, you can destroy both of these walls if you want. It is just an outhouse. I want to destroy both the walls. Uh, you want to? Yes. Can, okay. can it be drawn that those walls are out, you know? Like uh, like we did in the tavern. Yeah, just give me a second. See, like... Yeah, really angry the bear having a shite. For a Warforged, I feel like when they go into rage, it's kind of like a... Steam. <laughs> Yeah, like they kind of something happens to their armor and it gets a little bit thicker and a little bit of layer goes over it. But for humans, I feel like it's not that they're taking, it's not that they're not getting hit. It's just that they don't give a fuck that they're getting hit. So like they're taking the damage, literally. But for balance mechanics of being rage and having an idea of like how it actually works, the D and D just made it so you don't get hit. But it's like the honey magic don't give her. It's yeah. like, if you ever seen, like, the Vikings shit like that, like, the show, they'll go into battle and they'll get, like, sliced across the chest and just act like nothing happened and keep fighting. Pitch with a flesh wound. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, Adrian, you turn? Yes. Round bear. You're <laughs> <laughs> Wait, mate, I was just taking a shite. <laughs> Wait, mate, I was just having a shite. Leave us alone. Looks up to you. Gives a big old roar. He didn't wipe. <laughs> He's a. They don't. Our bears need to wipe, man, or else they just keel over. <laughs> Um, is this for real right now? Am I? Oh, phew. Okay. Um, you get buy buy it. Any saves I can roll or? Uh, no, no. Oh. You have your armor class. <laughs> no way. I'm di I'm dying right now. Really. <laughs> no, it doesn't eight hit. <laughs> doesn't eight hit. I don't. I think so. <laughs> what's, what's your AC? Just, 16. Just charms out of the wall of this outhouse that just fell down. <laughs> yeah, so he tries to bit by that at you, he misses. Ah, yes. He wait, tries to slash you. Wait, Slow. is your base AC 18? My base AC. Like, what's your AC right now? What's it say? 16. Okay, so 18 with rage. Alright. Yeah, I didn't think it's hitting. Okay, um, she tries to claw you, but it doesn't really scratch your middle armor. Comic! Yes. He throws some almonds at him. <laughs> <laughs> I wish. Um. I Robert Neville, September 5th, 2012, GA series serum. One, two, animal trials, streaming video. Use poison spray. Mm -hmm. 
So uh, you wall? extend your hand toward no at the fuck at the bear. Yeah, like, then move over to him. Oh yeah, of course. Don't get mad at me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's fine. So, you could just step move over here. You could just step inside. Yeah. So, so I imagine I heard the wall just broke down. So wait, I just step inside. And I the wall just melts. I take I take a step inside the outhouse. Mm -hmm. I see like oh the bear is gone. So I just uh, step inside, and I use uh, poison spray, which I, ex I basically extend my hand, and this noxious gas uh, comes out of it. And he takes this damage, or he uh, unless he rolls above a thirteen on the con save. So a con save. Con save. Yeah, um, you, you see poop in the toilet, by the way. <laughs> Constitution. Uh, 15. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Let me, let me check your scenario. Creature must succeed on the gun. Okay, <laughs> but that's it. He just... Yeah. Yep. He, he doesn't take any damage. It's like a... This puff of smoke in his face is like... Ah, <laughs> you as person can decide yeah, what's I, worse, I, I, the poop or your spray. I just, I don't even use poison spray. I just, with my hands, I just whiff over some of the shit air. <laughs> then, I, then I, as a bonus action, I vomit in the outhouse, and then I use the rest of my movement to step out. Do you vomit in the toilet? Yes. Oh yikes, as you get close, it gets really bad. So I just vomit in the toilet, and I imagine some fiery breath comes with it as well. So, yeah. So as I, as I like <laughs> vomit in the toilet, some of it gets lit on fire. Oh no! Hey, no, it, it gets extinguished with the vomit. Don't worry. I joke on you, you also get poisoned. Or can we, or can we make it like, uh, what's it called? Like, not actually burning down the whole outhouse, but just like this small toilet fire. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you set sure, it's a one shot. You set the shit on there, Jesus. Yep. Oh, so God. That's okay. five feet. Wait, wait, that's five feet. It's another five feet, so that's ten feet. And then. Uh, you have 15 oh. feet left. Boom. No, wait, 20, right? Because that was only 10 feet. Oh, yeah, I was thinking about where I was staying right now. Oh yeah, like that. Uh, yeah, you have 15. I wanna go over there and I, uh, I scream towards the monkeys. Murder that I make like some... Like, I, I grab my axe and I make like a swing. Like, um, as the gesture, like, I point at the bear like that. Fucking murder it. Mm-hmm. Okay. His turn. The wizard turn. Baggy. Wait, aren't the apes now? Uh, it's no, a... it's uh, it's young order. Give me a second. Oh wait, like that, yeah. Right. Yeah. Just gonna do this. Da. Fixed. Okay. Uh, Spaggy, as you see this guy. His eyes. Uh, he's going to say, oh, "Time to test the spell." His eyes turn blue as he disappears. What am I supposed to say? Oh no! Hello. Bitch ass ran away. Nope. Poaches. Oi. Okay. Um. Second. There is. A bit he was wielding a wand. Do you want to roll a can to uh, see what it was? Uh, sure. Why not? I like rolling dice. Yeah. Who, Who don't? <laughs> I like playing Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah. Dice. <laughs> you recognize it? It's a staff of true polymorph. But it looks modified. Something isn't right. <sighs> well then. 
Another um, fool tampering with magical okay. items. Okay. Oh, give me a second. I gotta read this, read this spell. In the sandstorm. Oh, oh yeah, by the way, the bear is large. That's my bad. Give me a second. It's large. That's why the house is so big. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um. Bears are like eight to ten feet tall. <laughs> and Luckily it's not a black bear. Anywhere from four to a couple thousand pounds. <laughs> Four hundred pounds to a couple thousand. Ah yes. Very accurate. Hey, uh actually looking at this fellow. Bellow. Use uh, <laughs> a despair. You see magical lines almost from over here over to there. And you see the wizard in the window in what appears to be his bedroom. The the wizard that we that uh Yes version just saw disappear? Mm hmm Alright. As the bear grows, punk ass. I'm big enough. Um, apes. Wait, wait. Never mind. Legendary action. What? Oh, he, uh, yeah. Yeah, because he can't cast teleport and enlarge reduce in the same turn without being a legendary action. Or maybe it's a homebrew spell. Well, even then, you can't cast two spells in a turn without it being a legendary action. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> no matter what the spell is. <laughs> oh, I just really want to get into a hit, sorry. <laughs> oh, I just assume in large reduce because that's the only in beginning spell I can think of. And yes, it's called in beginning. Huh? That was that one wasn't for you. That was for the viewers. <laughs> ah. <laughs> what is this? Beginning. It's the legitimate term for getting larger. Okay. So, so you can shrink and you can embiggen. Yes. But the word got changed to enlarge. You become big. That sounds so much better in beginning. Okay, yeah. um... Monkey Sins. Honey, I am big in the kids. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. The monkeys all have their swords in their hands. Man. Monkeys, fight! Yeah. It... Bear murder. Bear murder. <laughs> uh, come back. Yes. Yeah, they attack you. Why do they attack me? <laughs> what? I'm sorry. We had an agreement. <laughs> we had an agreement. Yeah, what should I see? Well, um, I'm these, very squishy, so 13. These monkeys are not men of their honor, of their word. Nah, they aren't even men. 
They were playing poker. They have to be somewhat men. Yeah. <laughs> why? Why did, can I know why they attacked me? Yeah. They betrayed you. Is it because I wanted? Were they friends with the bear? Yeah. Wait, didn't you? I technically I didn't even hurt the bear. No, you tried to. Just they were going to. I whiffed, anyway. oh, I whiffed over some shit air. I didn't try to. Oh. Give me a second. Should I just take that one then? I'm oh, sorry. Uh, sure, yeah. Wait, what was your AC? Two of them hit. Oh, yeah, I've got I wasn't GM rolling. Slash GM roll. I mean, yeah. two of them already hit, so my AC yep. is 13. You take 17 slashing damage. 17. Uh, 17. And I want to use my reaction. Uh, uh, what's it called? Hellish Rebuke. Well, it appears only, two of, them, only two of them could hit, unless this one is here. Uh, sorry, yeah, uh, this one moves up, hits, back. Alright. Um, so I point my finger and the creature that damage you is momentarily surrounded by hellish flame. Creature must- can I do this on both? Uh, only one. you point your finger only one? Okay, then I just, uh, the one that's like in front of me now, this one? Mm -hmm. I am I, or which, which of these two hit me? All of them. Oh, no. So, no. this one and this one behind. Okay, so then the one up front that hit me takes 2d10 uh, fire damage. Oh, wait. Sure it's on a failed save, so they in dexterity save. Yep. Otherwise, they take that damage. What's the DC? The DC is 13. <laughs> Yeah, it fails. <laughs> so it takes uh, 11 fire damage. But it, can, can I make it so the hell so it doesn't really surround them? But can I just make it like when they hit me, my skin is just so hot that it hurts them, that yeah, it like yeah. panels through the metal of their blade into their skin. Mm -hmm. So it takes uh, 11 fire 11 damage. damage. He looked fucked up. What? He look fucked up. You hit him hard. Jeez. Passion. <coughs> you got him. Ay, ay, ay. <coughs> He's dying. <coughs> oh you okay? Choked on spit. Yeah. I... I joked on my own spit. I did <laughs> Give that me a earlier. Second. I, I, I thought you inhaled too much <coughs> spit or something. I was concerned. <laughs> he chilling. Okay, I was trying to go talk, and it was like the spit went down as soon as I went to go say the word. Ah. Uh, oh. Pocky chilling. He good. Up. I thought that was the end. I thought that was it. <laughs> I thought you would heal too much smoke, but that's only possible. <coughs> no, I didn't even water. smoke. Oh wow. Just. I didn't hear your juice box. He just sucks us breathing. <laughs> he failed to breathe. Well, yep. I can't say. He just rolled that one on a con save for breathing. <laughs> yeah, that's what he did. So I'm gonna use my Zephyr Strike speed to get. Right the fuck here. <coughs> Through that door. Okay, give me a second. Uh, you do not know where he is. That's fine. I'm just, just disappeared. I'm just running through the house. Okay. And on on the way there, if there's anything loose, like close to a table or whatever, I'm knocking it off like a cat. <laughs> <laughs> Just 
just to be disrespectful. Uh-huh. And yeah, this is what you see. I assume I heard <clears throat> Korvac fighting the gorillas and stuff. Like, through this wall, I was here. I assume I heard them mm -hmm. before I left. So, like, as I'm running away, I just kind of shout out to Korvac. And I'm just like, just get in here and leave any of the issues you're having out there. Just just leave them there. Follow me. And I, I take I off. I convey this to uh, Sim. I... Like, so, but so, you know to get, so, so you know to get the fuck out of there. Good big bear once I'll do it again. Basically, I'm informing them, like, the the bears and the apes are the least of our worries. We just had a dude disappear, like. Okay. Um, is that your sin? Uh, do I have anything else I can do? Um... I'm just going... You have five feet of movement. <clears throat> I do? Yep. Oh, my Zephyr straight away. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna, like, press up against this wall <clears throat> and, like, mm -hmm. grab the door handle and just use my action to open it. Do you peek inside? Uh, yeah. Wait. But I'm gonna like fully swing the door open, but like hide back behind the wall and just kind of look in. Yeah. You want me to roll stealth? Uh, do you want to do it silently? Oh, yeah. I mean, I'm swinging the door open and then trying to like hide behind the wall. So like the door opening isn't quiet, but me hiding. Yeah, stealth please. Oh, it just, so it just lo lo looks like, like no, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Eleven. Mm? You feel silent. You feel silent. <laughs> I feel silent. <laughs> you feel like you did a good job. Just like, I got this. <laughs> got this. Let's go. <laughs> Do I see anything inside of the room? On a nap. On a nat one, it would have been like he hit perfectly, and it was like, yes, I hit so perfectly. <laughs> yeah, um, do I just in? Yes. Hmm? Yes. Simeter. Let's see what's good. Go to Big back. Bear once, so I can sure as hell do it again. Move back down. I'm gonna use my old reliable Posse Chaplin. Disadvantage. Disadvantage. Close You're range. Right in before him. Oh, close range. All right. Yeah. Oh, all right. I mean, you can also just hit him. Yep. Nah. Double. Oh, that would have been so perfect if you didn't have. Didn't hit disadvantage. It's still I. It's I. It's I. It's I. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh. You shoot him in the shoulder. Oh, it, it's actually called the fun sticks. Mm -hmm. Funny sticks. Yeah, that's what I named them. <laughs> oh, wait, it's, it's like, huh? The fun E sticks. Yeah, 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 but how do. What do you mean you named them? You can I just. Named them. Yeah, you can just take the javelin. You can just take an item and rename it. Oh, wow, I didn't know that. <laughs> the funny sticks are too powerful. Yeah. Give me a second. That's down. How much damage was that? Five. Five? Five? <laughs> okay. I broke the number one I carnal. I, I broke the number one carnal rule of Dungeon and Dragons. Split the party. Don't split the party. Well, I'm coming for you, but. Like... <laughs> I split the party. I'm I, I, I'm helping you. You can do whatever you're doing. <laughs> You're the least of my concerns at the moment. I'm fighting a big ass bear. No, but what I mean by it's like. Turn. Yeah, actually, no, 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 no. I want to move back. Uh, I want to use movement. 
You take a tag of opportunity. Mm, I think he can take that. He's he's during rage. He's, he's, he's got an 18. 18, yeah. He hit him anyway. <clears throat> so I can move, right? Yeah. You just make you need to make sure that you hit something again on your next turn. Or get hit. Or get hit. I bet. Oh, I should just move back to here. 15 feet. I think you can even do that with 10 feet. Yep. If you wanted to. Well, I think to get rid of your disadvantage is 20 to 60 feet. Yeah. What? Oh, right, I'll move back. To get rid of his disadvantage, hold on. To get rid of his disadvantage, he'd have to do this and be here. Because oh, I can do that. You need disadvantage, or to, to get rid of disadvantage on a ranged weapon, it needs to be 20 to 60 feet, or like longbows, for example, are yeah. 20 to 300 feet, or 150 to 60, 600 feet. Something like that, I don't know. But like, because I'm a ranger, I get advantage automatically with my weapons. Because, or like, the whole shit that I have, like, the way I built it. Which is why my longbow, even at short distances, doesn't get disadvantage. Because I'm like... Extremely yeah. like <clears throat> proficient with it from being the ranger class. Hey, do move I up imagine if you, have you have you played Horizon Zero Dawn, or have you at least seen the the cutscene where like one of the watcher thingies runs up to her and she slides underneath it and shoots it in the eye? So Connor, you want to move there? Yeah. Yeah. What do you Who you talking? Oh, token Finn. Yep. <laughs> Trust me, Nixo. Don't Jason? don't worry yeah. about it. I, I'm 23 years old and my voice still cracks. <laughs> yeah. uh, should I count it from here or from the middle? From the middle. You know the one problem with him making this bear bigger? <laughs> yeah. Look. You see all that? Oh no! Oh no, it's almost like there isn't squeezing moves. <laughs> you can't. Can you get up the stairs? He said, oh no, it's almost like there isn't squeezing rules. <laughs> I mean, I imagine he just walks through the outhouse. <laughs> no, I... <Yeah. laughs> I just love the way he just I said mean, that. That was... just an outhouse. <laughs> that was gold. <laughs> and it, can he even get up the platforms and through... Because that, that's just a normal-sized door, right? Yeah. I mean, you have to figure out. Uh, okay. Yeah, it... you can attack. Well... Did, didn't he get, Didn't the bear get the... Opportunity damage then since the or oh no wait he, no wait never mind it doesn't work like that he also didn't do his opportunity oh, attack yeah I've got the opportunity attack you all skip that yeah sorry devil's advocate <laughs> actually <laughs> nah I just remember wait, what let me not even say devil's advocate dungeon master's advocate <laughs> yeah okay holy I shit I think we the same. <laughs> Okay, you take. I was close to that gym rolling that. You take 33 damage. Damn! You take 33. You. Uh, give me a second. Yeah, I 33. take 33. Yeah. What was his to hit? What? He must have rolled like a nat 20 or something. Nope. Uh, uh, plus 7 damage. That's 40. After everything. What was the roll? If you don't mind me asking. Um, really high on everything. Is there anything I can roll to help against this? <laughs> Dude, you have an AC. <laughs> that's, that's like the thing to resist 
damage. Uh, also, uh, also, also, you're you're raging, which means you take less damage. Yeah, you take half that damage. Oh, okay, so I only take twenty, right? Yeah, you take twenty after all everything. Okay. I got you, fam. Eighteen HP. I got eighteen hit points left. That was a big hit by that. I got seventeen. In bro. You're. You have how much? I got 17. That's nice. I have 31. I'm shanked. <laughs> I have not been touched. I have. I've been molested by that. This is why. This is why you guys should listen to me and run away like a little bitch because the Rangers know the best way. Please, I will. <laughs> Never trust an ape. The monkey is a traitor of swines. In the great words of great, uh, in the great wait, words did that, of did the coin flip. wait, in the great words of Lord Freezer, never trust dirty apes. I'll drink for that. You fucking mm, monkey! Yo, Frieza is the most racist anime character, hands down. I don't even know who that is, but I I can get along with it. He's from Dragon Ball Z. Kovic, your turn. This man. I ain't got. This man calls more people monkey than I have ever heard anybody call anybody a monkey in my life. Oh wait, can I? Oh no, wait, no. You're going to take a, a, a opportunity attacks if you do that. Only two. Um. No, only one. Two. Oh, two. Yeah, five feet reach. That's just these two. <laughs> so you take it. Uh, well, I don't. I don't. I, do, I don't really have a choice, do I? Wait. Disengage. No, I'm, I'm, I'm definitely gonna. Yeah, but then I don't get like the sixty feet movement. You mm -hmm. just move here. Or here. Wait, you know, no, you know what? I have a better idea. Disengage. Um, I, I, I disengage. 30 feet yeah, under I the get bridge. Up to, I, I, I disengage, get up to there, and then I bonus action Misty step in there. Smart. So, uh... Big green. Spells. Second, let me cast Misty step. Wait, give me a second. Uh, can I help you, please? What do you mean? Um... Miss the step first, and then run away, and still have your action. Oh, because you don't need to disengage yes, yes, then. Yes. Yeah. Perfectly. Uh, Do you want to bless them on your way out? You want to want a misty step up the steps, and then mm -hmm. I uh cast. From from here. From like yeah, at the at the at the steps. Um, By the way, um, I'm going um, to be player's advocate again. Do you want some more help? I'll just blast! Uh, yes, I would like some more. Yeah, okay, you're standing here. It's uh, oh, fuck. It's uh, within 30 feet, you can see. There's a window right here. So you can stand here and shoot them. Yeah, yeah I, I am standing here. Oh, you're standing there? Okay. Oh, he was saying like you could stand inside, but <clears throat> I like it from here better. Yeah, because like from here I can actually like really hit them, and I wouldn't be able to move that. Oh wait, don't wait go. a second. Because if he's shooting through oh, a window, no, 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 he kind of has wait. to worry a half cover. How, how far is this? This is twenty-five feet. Yeah. So I can, can I still see him from here through the window? Yeah. The window is bigger. You can so, still see. So, so then I'm there, and then I still have my movement. So that would be, so that would mean I would be able to like stand right next to. Oh no no wait! Oh, I'll stand here then. Uh, after I did the attack, so just take that Eldritch blast and then through the window on the ape I already hit with my uh, hellish rebuke. Oh, hey, hey, I'm going to say he was looking like he was going to run. Huh? He was was looking scared. He didn't even look towards you. He looked towards what? the other way. Well, then I hit the the one behind him. Okay. Uh, please roll damage. Um, Uga Buga, die, bitch. Uga <laughs> Buga, die, bitch. Uh huh. 
Hello, Persian. Hey, ape students. These are gonna sprint away. Hey, Simon, you don't want to see this? This mm -hmm. one. It's gonna be. Uh, no. <laughs> Did he see me uh, running into this room from there? No, but he saw the other guy. The other guy? Eh, hey, sorry, Persian. How did he see Persian? He didn't. Oh well. <gasps> oh yeah. No, I've been in this room, but he would have seen you shoot out the window. He would have seen me shoot out the window, but he wouldn't see since there was like a door here. He wouldn't see us around the corner. Nope. So it's... he would know we're somewhere here, but he wouldn't know that we are like in the other room. Huh? Just give me a second. Let's move over here and set your on fire. A uh, baby, and after that, it's Persian soon. Okay. Ah, greetings, Kovark. <clears throat> and uh, the apes. Uh, ah, whisper, aren't whisper. Happy with us. Whisper, whisper. Apes are. The apes aren't really happy with us. Yeah, clearly. You don't hear them stomping around the other room looking for us. They they were with us. They we did that poker thing and they were with us. You never they trust turned. you you never trust an ape. I lived in the forest for many years. They are nice, but you never you trust them. Before you left. I needed to investigate. I mean the other I and I don't know where the honestly, others are. Honestly one of them ran away. That's fine. But I didn't trust, uh, what's his name again, Zymud, whatever. I, I didn't trust him enough to stay quiet, so I needed to leave on my own. I understand. I'm... What no. are we going to do with that bear, though? I don't think he can even move up into here, since the small doors, small steps, you know. Well, I did hear it roar, but what's wrong with the bear? It's just a bear. Because at this well, point, yeah. Uh, mind you, at this point, I haven't bit, seen that as but, giant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, so well, couldn't you? Can you look through that window? I, there was another window here. I was right? too busy looking in this and room the bear behind was standing here. Oh, oh yeah, all right. Uh, well, the bear uh, kind of expanded. He grew a lot. Well then, the big bear, big, really big bear. Well, I haven't found the man who disappeared, but I found a kitchen. How about we get rid of this ape on the other side of this door first, you know? Well, at least one of them got hurt by, you know, my fiery skin. Very well. He didn't look too good. Just... Well, if you said it's only one of them. Um, I'll stand... Back there, towards the door, on the south south end of the room. You open the door, and we'll, we'll prepare to take him out. All right. I mean, isn't this kind of your... Not your thing, you know? It's an animal. Well... Those who hurt my friends deserve to be hurt, and... What we were telling from the creatures we killed before turning back into men. I don't mind killing the creatures around this area. They all seem to be the same. And, honestly, you know more than the like that killing man isn't that bad. Well, you know, you remember the tavern we were at? <laughs> well, things happen. But Kill we... Killing man is the least of my concern. Probably just the left sham bread on your back. Oh shit. Oh yeah. <laughs> but we've just been like sitting here whispering in a corner. Yeah. Wait, um... I imagine like what. Your mic cut out. Mine? Yeah. Yep. Oh. Like, right when I turn around the corner and this monkey is searching for us, I imagine at the beginning of my next turn, Shine Bright will go like, BAM! 
Is it my turn? Uh, no. Uh, it is in the sand. Um, the gr gorilla shrink. Gorilla. No. Oh, sorry, my bad. The bear. Simmons, oh. you're the only one seeing this. Like how, how small do bear become? Like normal size bear? Large. Yeah. Wait, what? It's a, the bear becomes large, but it's smaller than it is right now. Yeah. I'm gonna like press my I'm gonna press myself up against this wall here, and just ready my action with the bow, and signal towards Korvok to open the door. Cause I'm gonna try and shoot this ape as he draws him Two. in towards the area. Because he told me that the Two. ape was right behind him. You video action? Yeah. Yeah. Anything else? Um, I'm just gonna cast Entangle. Uh, so... On a point that I can see. I am so sorry, Korvok. We're gonna have to deal with this for a little while. But it's gonna be worth it. Oh, wait, why? Is it from the center? Oh, snapped a corner. Yeah, you can change that. If you can draw a square around that. How do you do this from the corner? You can press snap to corner. If you click on the ruler, you can change setting. Okay. Snap oh. to corner. Wait. So four squares. Oh, that's cool. I want a no snap ping. Oh, this is like I can freely move it around. So one, yep. two, <laughs> I love the ooh sounds. Uh, can you guys stop? I can't see the grid. Jesus, what's going on? I am less sorry. Oh, I can even hide from other. I'm less sorry yes. for doing this now. <laughs> this is a big ass bear. Spaggy, you shouldn't be sorry for doing anything, you're just playing the game. Okay. I'm gonna murder you if you fucking... <laughs> Stop. Oh my god. Too many numbers. You... Dude, you can just hide it. Uh... Info. Oh yeah, I know. Yeah. I was just playing around. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if you want to continue, just hide it. Then you oh no, it's, no, it's alright. So yeah, I'm just gonna cast Entangle and then... Ready my bow as a reaction. So, uh, so you, basically, yeah. if he gets like, if the ape gets within this door, he gets a bow to the forehead. Yeah. So if you see the ape inside, you shoot. And that's the end of my turn. Yeah. yeah. Um, and this whole area is difficult terrain. Uh, you cast it in Tangle, right? Yeah, I'm about to put it in the... That's an action. Yeah, but I can use my bow as a reaction of later. That's what, like, you can use your... Instead of using, like, readying an action, you can do it as a reaction. As a reaction to open the door. To opening the door. Because I'm not opening the door or anything. Okay, all so I'm doing is like, open. yeah, basically all I'm doing is opening, like all I'm doing is holding my bow out, mm -hmm. and as soon as I see anything that moves, I let go. Right. And as, as long as it's not my friend, obviously. Yeah. Uh, unless, you know, that's what I was going to say, unless you know somehow... Zemood walks through the door right now before the ape walks through the door, then he might get shot. Uh, I'm, I am going to say I will not allow that if you use your action to, to shoot. If you had used your action, but it's fine. Okay. Um, so then the field would go away, or? Nope. Huh? But if he. No, it's fine. Uh, just matter for now. Um, Basically, because this is a one shot, he's saying it doesn't matter, but during Curse of Strahd, it don't matter. Oh, yeah. Okay. 
Sim mit. Sorry mit. The big ass Kissing. bear. Big ass bear. Uh, the bear is smaller now. I, I I still don't know what health it's on. Uh, no, it Good looks luck. a bit wound, wounded. Yeah. Just a question, how high up is this bridge here? Uh, I'll ping it. Give me a second. It, the first platform is 10 feet up, and the second is 20 feet up, so it would be 15 feet up. At a gradual incline. I... Yeah. So I, I ain't reaching that. <laughs> uh... Only choice is to attack this big ass man. I mean... Disengage and run away. Yeah, that is I a mean, that, that's kind of my was what my plan, but I don't, I don't, I don't, I... Hmm. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. This mm -hmm. disengage and I'm just, just fucking pull a sprint for it. Your choice. Just fucking pull a fast one. Yeah. I don't know who marks it in red, but I'm gonna go to that spot there. It, you have to go like this up to. Well, I mean then that would be. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Or maybe like this. I love it. Yeah, that that was kind of my game plan there. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I can pull a fast one. I didn't with this, did I? Yeah. Uh, you still have your burn section. Second rage. <laughs> what? No. Well, you're still raging. raging. Yeah. It's if you're next to him, you haven't been hit. Yeah. Then you lose your rage. So basically, on your next turn, you need to. Figure out how to Someone get. Okay. Figure out how to get into this room and aggro this guy. Yeah, just sprint into the room and lob a javelin at him. Boy, <laughs> that works too. Oi, you. Uh, do you enter turn? Monkey yeah. man. Oi, monkey. Just take a jump. Oi, monkey. <laughs> Oi, over here. Yeah. <laughs> monkey is like that. Oh, must have been a wind. <laughs> Hmm, must have been the wind. Must have been a breeze. Shizer. Bear. Big ass bear, what are you gonna do? The bear! Shit on it. Jeez. Can that bear even walk up those steps? Yes, it can. It, it works here. <laughs> and uh, through that door? Squeezing rules. That's a Find small out. door. So, I, mean, I imagine it would be a people sized door, right? You gotta find out. <laughs> no, I mean we would know how big the door is, right? We just went through it. Yeah. Uh, um. Do you know the squeezing rules, Emil? What are squeezing rules? Uh, basically, if a large creature tries to walk through a medium place, it can walk with a uh, difficult terrain. Oh. So yes, it can. That's why it could go through over here. It was larger. Um. That's why I made a joke of like, oh no, it can't fit. Shit. Night. Shit. Yeah. Bob shite. Yeah. So what's the bear do? Bob shite. If I take like seventeen down from this, I'm gonna be really angry. <laughs> you take. I'm murdered by this bear. Thirty-five you... damage. 22, yeah, that definitely hits. Yeah, you take 10 damage. So I five. take 5. Is that half? Yeah, it's half. Uh, 24 hits, you take 8 damage. 4. Wait, so how? 9. What? Half the damage. 9 altogether. Alright. Oh, I'm on 8 HP and I have no way to heal. I don't have healing potions. My bad, we're... Oh, oh yeah, oh, my bad. I forgot to say, <laughs> it won't have three healing potions. Oh. Three? Three. Oh. That's my bad. You could have told us that. <laughs> yeah, man, I forgot. <laughs> God damn it. Well, I've got out three they healing potions. Are they regular healing, or...? Regular. Okay. Nice. In that <laughs> case, I could have... In that case, I could have, like... Chugged one as a but technically, do you know that technically, but via the rules, 
it is uh, chucking a healing potion is an action. As long as it's, it's not in your con. bag. No, 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 no. Yeah, as uh, no. If it's always an action to interact with an item, only house rule for basically every player is chugging it yourself when it's on your belt as a bonus. Yeah. Yep. If, if you technically look at the rule book, it, it is a, a well, full action. The yeah, rule know, book can lick the dirtiest part of a hobo's butthole. Yep. That, that's how I feel. It's a fun section to chug. <laughs> If it, one's action to yourself, action to other. What I really should say is, what I really should say is, in that case, I wish I knew I had three healing potions on me earlier, because yeah, I would have handed them to somebody else. I haven't been touched, and I don't plan on being touched very much. Don't quote that. Wait, what what potion is it? Don't plan on being touched. <laughs> A potion of healing. I think Just like called. standard. Yeah, standard. Dun, 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 okay, dun, what, dun, what's dun. going on? Uh, it's the bear's turn. He was doing damage. Mm -hmm. He was adding his healing potions, and then it's your turn. Yeah. Call it. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna add them since it's just a one shot. I'm just gonna keep a mind note of them. <laughs> I added okay. one. Yeah. So, um, my mouse doesn't want to go into the. Oh, there we go. It's fixed. Um, I want to shove open the. Can I shove open the door from where I'm standing right now? Or do yeah. I actually have to move up? Since I just yeah, like... you can you can do it from that. Okay, so I kind of kick open the door and then I want to move. So this is difficult. So this is ten feet. Does this also count as difficult terrain? No. Uh, once you're out, you're okay. So yeah. this is just 10, that's fifteen feet over there. Fifteen feet. Twenty. Uh wait. Twenty-five. So so uh, yeah, I could go over there, right? Yeah. yeah. You have five feet more. And then I want to move up all over. Or you know what? I'm, I'm gonna move up. up, up wait. No, I got you. Move, move there. Yep. Okay. And I wanna. I still have my action and bonus action, right? Mhm. Mm so, first of all, wait. I wanna chug a. Oh yeah. Hey, you fat to shoot. Shoot your shot. Oh yeah. Oh, I, lucky. I was over. I was literally over here just staring at the screen. <laughs> Oh, what just happened? Somebody lift. Nope. It's the 14 hit. Uh, 14? A second. Hit! Please roll damage. Oh god. Four. Okay. I'm shooting toothpicks. <laughs> you, you graze his shoulder. It was a like, panic. You don't hit him, you're <laughs> it, just like... It was a panic shot. Does this make sense? Yeah. Yeah. That was so perfect. Mm -hmm. Like, you didn't even know that was going to line up that well. And I did not plan it out. I just moved my token, hoping for the best. Wait, I knew. I, I had done it. Because I was checking if there would be half cover. Fucking beautiful, man. I didn't even measure it, I just moved it, I was like, this looks like a good spot. <laughs> mm. Um, I think somebody turned on the toaster. Uh, Kovic, your turn. Oh no. Uh, yeah, I wanna chug a healing potion as, yeah, so. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I rolled two ones, and I'm, pl oh well. It's something, I it's something. The four hit points. Um, and then, hmm, what is something fun I can do as an action? Can I, <laughs> wait a second, can I, is the Donny Badger small enough so I will, he's on my back, like, oh yeah, he's on your back, nah, this, and this wouldn't work, would it, no, because the, 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 because of the window, Nah. Um. In that case, I wanted to use my action as to dash instead. So that means I still get like 30 feet of movement, right? Uh huh. 
and I want to move wait the, wait up the. into this tower. No. Until where? Um, it should go over. It should dash over. Um, door locked. Or the, the, wait. Where where was it locked? Is it locked here the door or this door? Uh, the door in front of you, this one. But hold up, give me a second. Kovac, there are yes. no doors locked when you're holding that axe. What have I told you? Wait, without the axe dashing, you can go down here. Okay, so then I, yeah. I... Well, I'm really bad at using this axe, so... Can I... Use my fire bolt to burn down the door? As in like, is well, as in concentrating the heat from the fire, fire bolt to, like, or would El or would I be able to blast like a hole in the door with my Eldritch blast? Do you want to try? Like, would that be possible at all? Would would that be possible? So I basically just push my mm -hmm. head, hand up to the door and just cast Eldritch blast. Mm -hmm. Would I even have to roll to hit then, since I'm basically like making it explode right in, like right next to me, the door? You'll have to have to roll, yes. I think to hit. I or feel hit like for damage, since I'm like standing right next to it. You get advantage, yes. So I feel like instead of doing advantage, he should have to do a Constitution save, so he doesn't blow himself up. That is true. Yeah, normal roll with Constitution because can't save. in my head, how it is is like I don't know if you ever played um. Shadowrunner, which is like a kind of isometric, you get to control like a, ma a mage, a gunner, and a decker. And in that, one of the things you could do is like walk up to a door with your mage, and sh she puts her hand on the door and just casts a firebolt, and it literally just melts the lock. It just like burns a hole through it, but it like causes a little bit of damage to her for casting it. And then the constitution save is basically to see if I can control the Thing enough yeah. to uh, not, not blow up, yeah. not to uh -huh. make it like a big explosion, but just to like disintegrate this door. Uh huh? And do I have to roll for damage, or is it just like then, or is uh, that con safe enough? Uh, no, to hit. To hit or for? To hit. Why to hit? Yeah, because it's, it's point blank. Yeah, but would got an AC. Oh well, twenty. Yeah, hit. And now damage. Oh yeah, hey, you must shoot. it. <laughs> oh, oh, it blows up. Okay, good. So, no, well, I can't walk through it because my action is out for it to pass. Yep. But but can I see into the room now then, or? Um, give me a second. Well, it wasn't the axe that you opened it with, but like I said, no such thing as locked doors around here. Always one with you. I mean, I am the lock breaker. I melted a lock. I melted a lock. I, <laughs> I blew up this door. <laughs> Slammed shut so hard. Well, <laughs> Came off or something. my greatest enemy is humanity. Yours seems to be doors. <laughs> Fucking hate doors. <laughs> Always oh in my way. I just like I, I pull out a, the, this, is, this is just character. I was gonna say this is just character because like my character is like apparently writing an index on all of the friends he meets along the way, and he just flips through the book to the seas and under Korvac loves almonds, hates doors, and then slams the book shut and puts it back in his back pocket. <laughs> <laughs> And, like, he doesn't say what he's writing. Like, he says it out loud without, like, saying what he's writing about. <laughs> just loves nah, just almonds. Just, I, I want to upgrade my name. Hates doors. <laughs> so this way, if anybody's like, what are you what, what are you talking? What are you writing over there? Nothing. <laughs> I, wanna, I want to upgrade my, no my name. Korvac, destroyer of doors. Lover of almonds. And destroyer of, or an interrupter of poops. Corvac doorbreaker. That's my back name now. <laughs> Corvac destroyer of doors and interrupter of poops. Yep. Okay. Um. Is that just him? Uh. Yes. Okay. 
Kisstöjn. That's that thing. I was close to spoiling. I can spoil. Sorry. And that's... Yo, this track is so badass. Yeah. I really like this. Okay. Yep. Uh, you guys see nothing. Ape. Mm, you know what? Uh... Runs out the window. <laughs> Runs and jumps out the window. <laughs> uh, it was going to run away. But... Wait, wait, wait. It has red. Yeah, that's no reason. Yeah, he jumps down. Um, he, he clamps down, sorry. Yep. He stands on the bridge. Pishin. Sorry, I was jamming. Um, I got a fun <laughs> question. Hmm. Um, Spaggy, I have a question for you. Secret corner? Yeah. Sure. I'm the only one left in this chat, seriously. Okay, mm -hmm. two seconds. What's up? Okay, um, I'm just going to send you this parrotly. What the fuck did you do? <laughs> you finally noticed the dick. <laughs> you finally <laughs> noticed the dick. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> That's absolutely hilarious. Look, man. Wait till oh, wait, yeah. wait till you see that in the recording. I drew that like an hour and a half ago. Nah. Dude, literally, I drew that like an hour and a half ago. You'll see it in the recording. <laughs> Just what so I have to know what it was. See what Spaggy draw drew. Yeah. Oh, yo, I drew that in... What is that? I, I drew a dick inside of one of the uh, black boxes. So that, like, you guys couldn't see it, but I was waiting for Nixo to see it. I drew that shit like an hour and a half ago and he just messaged me about it now and was like, what is this? <laughs> I was like, oh, you found the dick! <laughs> I think that's gonna be my new thing. I'm gonna start drawing a dick in every single one of my maps. You gotta find it. <laughs> but it's not gonna be easy. Where's the dick? I drew, I drew in my backstory. Backstory. Where he loves almonds, hates doors. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, yeah, it's your turn. Huh, seems that ape have got has gotten off, uh, has gone and run off. Very well then. Last chamber is here. I kind of kind of like when he tries to walk through this door. Kind of how a butler or like a door guard would open the door. I just gesture to what was once a door, like make way, make way like. like like, like, enter here. I kind of, like, do a little like, bow towards him. My hand. I, I do a slight bow towards him and walk through the door. And I assume there's well, another... Uh, what? Um, before you do that, before I turn... You heard the sound of wood crackling, like smashing. Not a problem. I've got this. Yep. Yes, sir. Kovac, there appears to be people having... A little bit of fun in this room. I hear the creaking of wood. <laughs> Are you prepared to intrude once again? I heard your little encounter with the bear. Uh, can't we just light this part of the tower on fire? Eh, I think it'd be more fun to see what's going on inside. And I just get like this evil grin on my face. I kind of like start to, in my hand, crackle some fire. I'm gonna obviously take concentration off of the entangle. 
So, look here. I'm out of spells. I'm at my last draw. I still have one. I've used quite a bit and of I arrows. Know, I know exactly what I'm gonna do. Wait. But, but like after the Zimmet and the Bear has bought. Which is like I've used quite a bit of arrows, but I believe everything coming here has led to this moment. Let's do this. And I just turn around and kick the door in. Yeah. Um. Uh, peaceful athletics. This is gonna hurt. I'm, I'm going to give you badass ad, uh, advantage, cause that was really badass. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you can get inspiration, you choose if you use it. For the great speech. Yeah, I'm going to. Yep. <laughs> Let's do this! <laughs> kick doors doesn't burn. <laughs> Uh, first time I kick it, I'm just like, ah! And I turn around and I go for another one. I'm like, no, boom! And I go for another it one. It breaks the point, like how police use the ram, but you just do it with your foot and you break the lock off. <laughs> no, it, uh, it's still locked. He didn't succeed. He didn't. <laughs> no. I just kind of like turn back around. Just walk in here. Wait, hold on. I was here. That's ten. Wait. Ten. Just, just gonna sit down. And I put, I put Pally down on the table. Mm -hmm. And I just sit in the chair. And you know, like a king sits with like his one leg up mm -hmm. on the table, his arm kind of like his hand on the armrest, and just. Other hand resting on his chin. King, oh my god! Like uh, King Baldra from uh, Skyrim. Yes, but except my my legs script, sitting yeah. up on the table. Because he always sits like a little sideways in his chair when he's lounging. Do you know what? Yeah, I mean? with his like arm on okay, it. Yeah. yeah, his head holding up with his fist. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's exactly how I'm sitting right now. Just like I'm better than everyone. Just like God damn it. You know what? I gave a good speech, and that's all I can do. Kovac, burn the tower down. I'm done. <laughs> what are we doing with Zimmet and the beer? Uh, uh, we're going to wait. Cause, yeah. Rise of As. I like all these songs from this uh, legendary battle music. Mm. Just, I just love the fact that my character tries to kick the door. And he's just like, you know what? Fuck it, burn it down. <laughs> Like, honestly, I've been playing a lot of this art. Uh, I've been playing a lot of this game Hades, and it's so funny because oh, yeah. Artemis is such a sweetheart in the game. But at the same time, you have these you have these rooms where you get a choice, and you have to choose one or one god or the other. And if you choose, like, say, my favorite one of the rooms is uh, Ares versus Artemis. If you choose the Ares rune. Artemis is like, wow, you really, she's like, I'm, I don't know the exact quote, but she's like, wow, you really just did me like that. Alright, fine. And then she just sets mad enemies on you and starts, like, hitting the room with these, like, green circles that kind of spin around the room. And then if you get inside of them, it, like, shoots an arrow, like, a rain of arrows down on top of you. Bro, Ares, Artemis is not somebody to play with. But then again, I always choose Ares over Artemis because... Ares' challenge room is so much worse than Artemis's. Which makes sense. The god of war is so much worse than the fucking god of the hunt. No, dude. Artemis's, or Ares' fucking challenge room is just constant of those red spawning orbs instead. His is red instead of green. But if you do get inside of them, they cause doom. Which you saw me using Doom the other day. Yeah. It's and insane. Yeah, you don't want that casted on your player character. That is a no-go. I have not survived yeah. one of his challenges. Like, Zeus is easier than him.
But that's because Zeus is predictable. He gives, like, his yellow circle shows up, and it's there for, like, a long time. So you could just literally walk around it before any lightning comes down in that area. Is this after Asgard? Or Asgard, what the fuck am I saying? Uh, is it Asgard? Olympia. Or, or, or what, what is the second? Oh, the oh second. Elysia. Or you have Asphodel. Asphodel. Yeah, Tartarus, Asphodel. No, these rooms just pop up randomly now. They just started coming out of nowhere. I wasn't getting them, and then all of a sudden I started getting them. I'm gonna start recording. Maybe you reach a certain level. Yeah, I'm gonna start doing streams of it if you wanna watch. I'll probably do it like once a day for two or three hours. You mean like in uh, streaming it as in sharing your stream? Or streaming on Twitch. Streaming it as in on Twitch. Cool. Because I have nothing else to do besides go to work. I got the game myself since you said it was so cheap. Let me check it on. I hope it's still on sale. Better. Days gone, fifty percent off. Oh wow! I didn't even want to get that game. <laughs> oh fuck no. Oh, I got off the bundle is there's ten percent off the bundle of uh, and the soundtrack. Uh, why would I want this? <laughs> Wait, I I don't know which one I got. No, it was like a bundle with the game and the soundtrack. Why would I want this? Yeah, no, I just have the game. Let me check what it's on instant gaming. Uh... No, cause I just bought Darkest Dungeon and I bought the whole DLC pack for it cause it was only ten dollars. Still 19 euros and 30 cents on uh, to call instant gaming. If he doesn't, I don't, I just messaged him. I don't know if he's going to come back, but we should probably just hold off on his turn and just keep yeah. going with the combat. If that's alright with you, Nixo. Because I still have to go to work at 4.30. Nixo? Very well then. What? Oh. Hi. I said we should just like carry on for now until he comes back. Like skip his turn for now until he comes back. Okay. Uh, we won't skip the battle with him? Yeah, we'll just hold yeah, off. Yeah, right I imagine it would then when, when he comes back is just his turn, bear's turn, his turn, the bear's, yep. bear's turn again when we get back to it. Word. Comic. Your turn. Well, at this door, I want to cast Firebolt, but not to destroy the door, but to light it on fire. Mm -hmm. Uh, so so I w just want to light that part of the room on fire. Can I do that? Can I try? Or do I have to roll the hits and something? No. Okay, so then I just what, the, what do I roll then? Nothing. The door's burning. <laughs> the door's on fire. <laughs> huh? Okay. Uh, and I don't know if that works. Wait, let me let me check something. Uh, let me check my thumb for a few. Does take an action, so that Back doesn't up work. Some. But then this would be my next turn that I would be able to use this. Well, in that case, I want to use my bonus action uh, to chuck another potion. Yep. Uh, That's issue with me, Dirk. So I healed seven. Seven. Okay, yeah, that was my turn. Yeah, okay. Lovely. Um, oh, yeah. Hey, you guys. Uh, trying to burn this tower? Shambright's trying to stop you? Can we do anything on your back? 
Can I throw him off? Like, oh, I wanna, sure. I wanna throw him off and, uh, just, yeah, push, push him away, like, don't. Yeah. He's there. Hey! His turn. She's about to go down. We don't even know what's in this room. Mm -mm. This... Um... There? What? Uh, give me a second. Be down here? You're on the right? Yeah. You're right on. No, he's going to do this. No! <laughs> It's the He's taking us with him. Yeah, for convenience. <laughs> no, don't move. No, no, so you can move him freely. No, oh, oh, I'm already moving. He's here. Oh, alright. Uh, he smashes the roof. He's 30 feet in there. Um. I'll just do this. It's where you're there. How do I... Uh, give me a second. Do we, do we still hear the creaking in that room? Oh no, it was just a creak. Uh, him shelling the roof. He smashes down through this roof. He is going to cast that spell on the string. Hey, how lovely. Hello. Greetings. Oh, can, we do the, can we do the bear and like... Yeah. 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 Because there's only one round. What would you like to do, Zimit? Hold on, I've got a reopened roll 20. Well, yeah. Did you turn your fuck toaster on? No. Maybe. We all know that that's what happened. No, my audio drivers just decided to not. <laughs> just did not. <laughs> just did not. Well, I've opened roll 20. Yep. What you doing? I'm... Uh, let me just open a... DLB Beyond real quick. Alright, there. Oh. My DLB Beyond open. Uh, you know what I'm doing? Wait, hold no. on a second. <laughs> no, it's your turn. <laughs> Why is there an ape there? It's the ape on the bridge. No, he's on the ground, yeah. below the bridge, I thought. Nope, it's on the bridge. Oh. Fuck oh, that. Nah. I'm gonna sprint into this box right here. You disengaged. Oh. Wait, can I... Is... Yeah, disengage. I don't want to, like... Hag... Actually, yeah. Sprint here, then sprint here. That's allowed. It, the ape is under. The bitch. Oh, he, he's under the bridge. Like he's hanging down. Right. He's on it, but he's hanging off of it. Like he's about to yeah, drop all down. Right. Alright, never mind. So I'm gonna just go here and go here. What? Well, if you have I'm 30 down, feet. Am I able to attack from this? Yeah. Are you trying? I have 30 yeah. feet, but I don't know how. Good. You could get into that room. I'd still be on the bridge. No, you can get directly into the room. This this one. This this one. Did I? No, you're you're doing so much extra. This one. Wait, you go here and you go there. Oh yeah, I could. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna do what Sparky did, and just. Sprint for it. Yeah. <laughs> there. Please move. Mm -hmm. Inva invading the bear. And hopefully the gorilla. And then the bear's turn, or you have anything else to do? I don't think I can attack at the moment, and I'm not. <laughs> 
I don't and I'm too afraid to attack. So I've eight HP. Actually no. Am I able to use like a potion here? Yeah, bonus section. Alright, bet. <clears throat> Did you just look in chat and saw that my roll and you were like, oh, I want that as well? What? Oh, no, I'd... Oh, alright. <laughs> I just thought I've got 7 HP. I should probably heal. <laughs> Backpack. Where is it? Equipment. Mm. Oh. Equipment. Apparently I don't have it. Yeah, it says it. Yeah, let me just add it to my possessions really quickly. I did sweet potions. Here. In all reality, you can just do this. Oh, wait, what? no, you can't. It doesn't work, never mind. I thought you could just click on the potion of healing in chat and it would reroll it, but it doesn't. Wait. Potion of healing. And then. I mean, you can just roll 2d4 plus 2. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, just, just press the just press the pink. Shoot you fall. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure. I think. Really that's for what it oh great. Wait. I roll for six. or oh, I heal for six anyways. Uh, yeah, because you. Yeah. Oh wow. <laughs> we rolled the same. Yeah, you get. Yeah, you get the first one. You rolled a one plus three. Yeah. I rolled a two plus two plus two plus two. Wow. Well. So two, plus two plus two is six. <laughs> ah yes. I remember that line being different. Two plus two the plus two. Is, no, it's two plus two plus two is six. Two two. Oh, Watch this guy with the funny sticks. <laughs> yes. I got bars. Um, that's the end of your turn, my friend. We. Oui. Do you end your turn? Yep. It's Timut. It's not. No, it's not tricks. We. Oui, I end my turn. Oh, for God's sake! Why is there a big ape? Oh no, the ape is like underneath the bridge. Oh no, yeah. not the ape. Sorry, the bear. Hold on. Justin. Problem is, every time he would go through a door, it would be 10. Yeah, he's dashing. 10, 20, 30. Yeah, that that still means... Wait. Uh, every time it would go through a door, so that would mean... From where was he here, right? I've... I know what I do. Would, would, would this be considered a door? Yes. So that... that that's 10. So... It's 30. Uh, you don't need to calculate. It's 30. It's, there's three doors. Oh yeah, 30. I already done it, guys. movement and a part. How does this work? Uh, um. Ah, uh, never mind, I'm bad at math. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, thank God. Yeah, in 10. Um. Back to Drake. Um, Dragoon. It's going. Do what we call a thick move in the this industry. Well, thanks. <laughs> oh, yeah, by the way, it's a big a fucking bit. dragon. <laughs> this is a bit, uh, it's a bit wimbling. A what? Bit, uh, it's a bed dragon. Yeah, y you, you can see it's made out of a and bit. Also, if you zoom into the token, you can see it. Bed? Its body, it, bed? its Sleep. body is made out of wood. Its wings are made out of linen. Like, yes. Yes. So, Spaggy, please make me a dexterity saving throw. Can I sleep on the dragon? No, I could not sleep on it. It's a bed. <laughs> it's not yours. <laughs> Who says I can't sleep? Eat my cakes. Goldilocks slept in someone else's bed as well. <laughs> yeah. Emil, sure. If you if you convince the dragon to be yours, yes, you can sleep in it. Eat my cakes. No. 
22. You said that like it was like a multiple cent. Like, 22. Wait, please roll for the badger, by the way. Badger doesn't give a fuck. Bad I mean, no, the badger doesn't give a fuck. Badger don't give a fuck. I'm trying, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> this is one of the greatest one shots I've played so far. Oh, that's good also, to you. Also, also one of the only one shots I've played oh. so far. <laughs> I mean, we flipped swaggies. But I mean, th it, this has been a one shot with a lot of backstory, I'd say. Yeah. And with it's a lot of good. dumb things and backstory. This is going... Hold yeah. on, I have to read this real quick. Uh... It, also, this is going to be a free shot. Wait, choose a beast that is no... Okay. Add your proficiency bonus to the beast. Okay, so... Oh... Uh... Yeah, no. What's that? Four, six. By the way, I imagine we hear the bear walking into the room next to us, right? Yeah, uh huh. All right. That ain't silent. Six. Sorry, what? I rolled a six. A six, what? Okay, it, it takes 26 damage and you take 13. Okay, I have a question, by the way. Yeah. Since it's a bed dragon, does Plus, it have... This fucking what? dragon's gonna die. Since it's a bed dragon, does it have disadvantage against fire? Mm hmm You can try. Would, would I... Would I know it would have... That it... Since it's a bed... <laughs> no, it, Yes! It clearly was some so, bed, and a shloot... Look into the bedroom, uh, fire, you know, you can see, there's no bed. Uh, <laughs> no, so, so I would know it's the bed. You would uh, know it's the bed. Would I know it have, has disadvantage on... C can I roll intelligence for that? Um, or something? No, uh, Persia. Do you think fire is going to be effective? Persion in, in that wake, because you just did more than half my badger's damage, Looks at Korvac and goes, I don't care if it's resistant to fire or not. Fucking kill this thing. <laughs> As I look over, well, uh, it's not my way. Yeah. Continue. You may continue. Is it? Does a dragon go on his turn? I imagine, right? Uh, yes. Alright. Shit would be way too much. Otherwise, um, da, 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 and T is going to do this. Ba -da, ba -da, ba -da. Um, Kawe. Oh. oh, it's first. Sorry, Kawe. Kawe. Oh, uh, oh I, I don't think the thing is going. The order is going. Is scrolling down for me. It. He no, didn't. Yeah. He didn't move it yet. It's still on eight. Yeah. Um. Kovac, yes. you. Give me a second. Your AC is 13, right? 13. Yeah. I know it's not that high. 13? 13. 13. 13. 13. One free. <laughs> what, one free? What? 13. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, one three. Yes, thirteen. Yes. Yeah. Okay. You take. Um. S. The rider. Huh? First, this magic at you. You take. Ten. If. Cold damage. I am very confused. You take ten cold damage because no casted a spell at you. Probably chill touch. My favorite song. Of the battle song. Okay. Um. Uh. 
Uh, yeah, sure. Ape! Where? Where did they Ape out of here. Uh, you know what? Uh, all the apes, uh, you will not notice. Uh, I'm going to be be uh, I'll hear This is meant for more than us. Huh? This is meant for more than three people. For how many people is it meant? Four to five. Four to five level four to five or four to sixes. Yeah, and we're level uh, well we are level four. There's only three of us. We really should be level six if there's only three of us. We are gonna get destroyed by this dragon because I'm on nineteen hit points. You? Eighteen. And my literally most useful item is dead. Uh, please say Persian is uh, gonna be in Nixos campaign as well. Dead and, uh, ass. Uh, no. 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 Ah. Because that would be so great. If my other character dies, then yes, but no. Definitely. Because my other character... Like a long-lost brother. My other character is very... built for that campaign. Like, I can't reveal anything more than it's built for that campaign. Yes. Uh, we're going to end the session now, but before I end it, uh, Percy, mm -hmm. you're the egg you picked up. It starts flying up in the air. The what I picked up? The egg. Oh. The, the big. <laughs> he doesn't know it's an egg. <laughs> the rock, the shiny rock. <laughs> That's why I'm like, the what I picked up? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it starts flying up. Oh, by Artemis! <laughs> Shining out radiant light as you all gain a level and can use your rest dice. You all gain a level and the effects of a short rest. Gang shit. The effects of a short rest. Mm -hmm. uh, I, wanna, I wanted to do something. I wish this, I wish this would have happened just before I, so I could have casted another fellow, it's alright. <laughs> But yeah, uh, that's the session for today. Awesome sauce. Yeah. Indeed. Mm -hmm. nice. So that's do you do you want to pick up next egg. week or do you want me to? Can I? Yeah. Cool. I'm perfectly cool with that. Um. Yeah, I was scared this was going to be too hard. That's why I decided to do this. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's what I was just telling them, is this is meant for four level fours, or four, like, four to sixes, like... Like, action economy-wise, we are, like, the three of us are outplayed, out action economy-wise. Okay, I just wanna... Sparky, what would be better? Better. One time, uh, 4d6... Or a possible three time 2d6. Because, like, it could also be that two of them hit and only one of them doesn't hit. What is this for? Only one of them hit. Uh, scorching Ray or Burning Hands. Well, Burning Hands hits definitely and does 4d6 damage only. Uh, it's close range. Yeah. I'd go Burning yeah, Hands. Yeah, this thing is up and down. It ranges from self up to 15 feet, so. Yeah. I mean, like, so Burning Hands does 46 damage only if they fail a con save, or a deck save 13. But Scorching Ray is uh, what? But Scorching Ray has to roll to hit. And yeah. And there's 2d6 per ray, which there are three of. Three of. Isn't that four because you're upcasting Warlock? Yeah. You have when to upcast for being a Warlock. Using a spell slot of oh. an additional ray. Oh no, so it does it. 12th, 3rd level. 
No, it's only it, it's using spell slots. Oh, it's just second level. Oh, wait, wait, I haven't I haven't upgraded it yet. Let me. Well, I got a hit out. All right. Uh, I'll call you later. Yeah. Yeah. Peace. Oh, I can 